What's happening, world? Happy Friday. Welcome to another episode of Cognac Confessionals. I'm your host, Deshaun, here at Where Media Meets Studios, in conjunction with VJTV, Feral Films, okay. History in the Making Entertainment, Keep It Cloudy Productions, uh, shout out to the Venus Lounge, Camouflage, uh, Drop Knock, uh, make sure I ain't forgetting nobody. Uh, what's happening? It's uh, Friday. October 11th, 2024. Before we even start, I want a happy heavenly birthday to my grandma, 101. Happy born day. Hey. Happy born day. You know what I'm saying? My favorite teacher. Okay. Yeah. Definitely. What's your name? Yeah. We got a great show lined up for y'all tonight. I'm going to let everybody introduce themselves, starting with my co host to the left as usual. Hey, what's up, man? It's Bay Area's number one filmmaker. Uh, the Donald Goins of filmmaking. It's your boy, aka Feral Films. Oh, it's my turn. Yeah. The Andrea Nicole. <laughs> hey, what's up, y'all? It's Do Rag, aka Canary underscore comedian. But today I'm Do Rag, so don't disrespect me. Canary at home. Canary at home. Yeah. That's what's up? We're covering. Canary's at home. We got Do Rag tonight. We got our brother. That's what's up. Hey. Right. So I want to uh, welcome y'all to the show. Hello. Uh, thank you for thank having you us. Thank you for having us. Seeing this evening. Mm-hmm. Let me take a little sip. Yeah, you know, thank it's you. It's already a cheers, spicy cheers, here. Cheers to a, to a great night. Uh, Period. An open free night. Feet. Oh, yeah, most definitely. Cheers to a great night. Cheers sure. to y'all out there watching it. Okay. Internet land. So, for those that don't know y'all, Tell us about yourself, who you are, where you're from, and you get down. I, mean, I know y'all, 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 y'all be having stuff cracking, so mm-hmm. <laughs> get into the proceedings this evening. Y'all can catch us on Mondays, sipping tea with sugar and spice. Myself, Andrea Nicole, and Canary underscore comedian. Um, you wow. know, it's a little spicy little Monday pick-you-up show for it to start the week, you know, give mm-hmm. you the funnies, and, you know, we just be chilling, and, you know, y'all didn't tuned in to us before mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. I'll be mm-hmm. trying to take her on a date. She mm-hmm. be acting funny, you know. This is my why life. is that? Oh. Yeah, why is that? I like guys. No, I am Still, a guy. Hmm? Let's do that. Right. What that mean? Right. It's all to egos. I let I let him take me to seven eleven. Okay. Oh, that's right. <laughs> and I was able to spend my last E B T on you. Mm-hmm. You feel me? I was hungry. I did to the I did not put the chips in the soda. E B T has saved a lot of uh rub my chest. You can put it in the <laughs> no. Yes, she did. Uh, I was in the hospital. Well, I was, and you still made it through. Yeah, I mean, that's what I'm talking about. If y'all want to make it in this industry, that's the level of dedication you got to have. You got to be about that shit. Look, and that's on period. Sometimes I just when be nigga told me one time, oh blood, I got shot, I can't make it. I'm like, nigga, what's that? <laughs> Band-aid on that shit and suck it up, buddy. Walk it up, with some robot testing on that. You know what I'm saying? Walk it up, robot testing. That's crazy. Hell of funny. Where my lip gloss at, baby? That's crazy. Where my lip gloss at, baby? I don't know. Oh, shit. You slipping over for me. Whoa. Mm-hmm. I'm not your keeper. Okay? I'm hoping you put the lip gloss on and give it to her the hard way. Yeah. Transfer. Oh, you know what? We don't do <laughs> Oh, don't blame me. It's, it's the yak. We don't mm-hmm. do those things over here. It's Man, the yak. We do all of that thing. <laughs> okay. We do it all, baby. Uh, sure. Don't be lying. <laughs> so, do rag. Yeah, uh, baby. Tell us about yourself. What's so you know, do rag is a a boosty ass nigga. <laughs> you feel me? I was born a woman, but I'm a stud. You feel me? Those okay. days, uh, Canary be like, you know, do me. So I do me when Canary mm-hmm. let me. You know, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. come on outside. But uh, alter ego. Yeah, you know, yeah, she got I a few that. of them, but I'm yeah. the main one. You know, mm-hmm. got this beautiful lady. You feel me? In my mind. Hey, uh, she mine. So, I'm just know. in the instigate. <laughs> Y'all on her up? Uh, you know, Canary is a real star. She be uh, <laughs> she on TikTok and shit. You know, mm-hmm. doing her thing. Just in the did hospital. a short movie. She did a short movie the other day as Auntie Crackhead. She be doing a lot. Mm-hmm. You know, she's everywhere. Right. Got to get to know her. She got a pussy out behind Seven Eleven all the time. Mm. Bust it open. Sucking dick. <laughs> Trying to get rich. I want tree trunks. No comment. So, <laughs> so how did y'all get started? Me and her together or separate? Either, tell y'all a story. How'd you get started? I got started in jail. Okay. <laughs> Everybody kept telling me 
hey, you got some like talent. Like you need to do something with your life. And I was throwing, mm-hmm. um, I was throwing shows in jail. And I was like, nah, I'm just here to do time. You know, like yeah, I, I thought I was only gonna be a good booster. I wasn't gonna be nothing else. Okay. And so, I mean, I got started in jail too. I used to write letters for niggas. Okay. And somebody said, "Hey, blood, you really talented. You should write for real." Yeah. And I got out and I started writing. That's yeah. how I did. And then I ended up going to school. Yeah. Somebody told me, "Get out and make them laugh. You do it all the time." So I got on Instagram and. I made him laugh, and I was like, "Oh hey, shit!" Speaking of that, shout out to Lucky Dollars. Right, okay. he got the same His day, in his last day in prison, they said, "Blood, we better see you on stage somewhere." Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay. And he kept and he the got, promise. And he got on stage. Right. Yeah, shout out to him. He he got the same similar story as me. Uh, Nothing sure. like being in jail for people to actually recognize the talent. They, exactly. Especially when somebody. Though. In such a cutthroat environment, like in my place, one of the worst killers I ever knew, mm-hmm. he walked over to me and I was like, oh shit, mm-hmm. I'm not even strapped. Yeah. Right. Because you in jail. And he said, no, nah, I just want to talk to you. I'm going to tell you, you're really talented. I wrote mm. some other letters. You should, when you get out, you should go do that. Now, if a killer told you to do it, you need to go on the bed. <laughs> but he's, he's a- never going to come back home. <laughs> so he can't enforce it, but I but promise fulfilled. Okay. I've, wrote, I've written 15 scripts, two novels, and so I've I've written. Okay. You need to write for us then. We look like we're about to get in the building with you, Farrell. Because okay. we are I actors. Like playing to me. I mean, you look how I look today. You uh-huh. Know? I got purple because I smoke purple. You know, feel me? Easy, Say easy. that there. <laughs> yeah, that's what I do. I've got the bitches touching on my chest here. Come Shout on, out to Von Trap. Rub it on my chest. Come Von Trap are tuning in. Chris Rub Boy it, baby. Yeah. In. I know you got to kind of commit to it. Yeah, she didn't want to That is committing. <laughs> that's a so, commitment. Uh, Dre, how you get started? Yes, how you how get started? did I get started? Yeah. I'm coming out the womb. My mama said I came out stumping in my freaking cowboy boots singing Tina Turner, What's Love Got to Do With It? What? I believe it. Mm-hmm. Ooh, Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> so you didn't even like to get to the church choir and then you just came I off didn't the see, we didn't. I grew mm-hmm. up as a Jehovah Witness, so we didn't go to church. Mm-hmm. <laughs> But you every time I used, man, you stupid. Look, I, they used to force me to do it, but you know, it, I know that, it gave and me. I know they would appreciate your current outfit. Uh, you know what? Mind your business, okay? Mind your business. Anyway, so I used to be singing at the Kingdom Hall, and everybody used to be turning around. Y'all wasn't you know, so y'all wasn't singing for Jesus. Who y'all singing for? Y'all for Jehovah. Y'all said the Kingdom Hall. Y'all, church people sing for Jesus. What would y'all sing for? We sing for the same things. They don't celebrate Christmas. Though. I know. They don't do I'm trying to get her Christmas. Y'all, everybody be having know. things about Jehovah Witnesses misconstrued. Oh, I don't like know. to get into it. But I, know, I don't like. I, I, don't, I don't do religion. I I'm like, neither. I don't do religion. But Jehovah Witnesses believe in Jesus and God. Okay. Oh shit! Yeah, I convert. Don't ask. Look at you, nigga. Like I literally don't know. You know, I ain't bad. I'm not a religion. It'd be more of a brainwashing thing because people be wanting people to be stuck to one type of religion. But if you don't know a lot of things, like how can you freely understand anything if you don't even listen to other people when they talk? You know what I'm right. saying? Well, I've studied it because I learned no, no, because because whenever I'm in a relationship, whenever her birthday or Christmas comes up, I convert. <laughs> oh, you do? You're like, hey, yeah, so you know, no birthday come this day, baby. So he don't gotta buy. We just hold witness today, baby. Don't do it. Hey, you know what? Valentine's I need to, Day where, bitch? I need to teach that to my kids. <laughs> Y'all are hella stupid. For real. <laughs> Like like Chill Mac, Sorry. the famous comedian <laughs> J. Anthony Paquette, also What's known summer? as Chill Mac Comedy, has a question in the comments. Okay. Oh, this nigga said is you ticklish. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> who ticklish? Me? You I mean, you rat? You rat? I think that was in response to, to the, the city. Sa- safari. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> you know what? Titty. Leave me and my cheetah alone, okay? They ticklish. Did you do that? Yes, they sensitive. Okay, Come here, so you mind your business. That's not that's my business. Okay, so you came out the womb with the, with the <laughs> Tina Turner uh, karaoke and yeah, I just love music. Like my my family, they had like friends who you know we used to go the Bible study with and stuff. They used to have like backyard you know get-togethers and stuff, playing harmonicas and instruments, and okay. they kids would be singing and stuff like that. Shit. So you said, huh? The wind flutes. The wind <laughs> flutes. <laughs> So, but you know, music just really interests okay. it interested me. So I took a um, liking to it or whatever. And now, do you have sure. any albums out? Yeah, or? I got music out. I and started, then what's the name it's under? Um, it's under the Andrea Nicole T H E E. The 
She bougie. <laughs> well, right. it's, no, it's hella Andrea and Nicole she don't out even there. So I had to. Everybody is. First of all, mind you, <laughs> stop telling people my business, do rag. Hey, you don't eat lasagna, my bad. I you do eat lasagna. lasagna. I don't eat she the don't frozen eat the lasagna. Stuffer. I like to she make bougie. my stuff no stouffer. from That's scratch. Right. And that, we ain't doing really? no box yes. shit. I'm a from scratch type of eater, okay? We ain't having no motherfucking Jiffy cornbread over like here. I like jar I love Jiffy. I make like my that. own sauce. <laughs> Right. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with a little Jiffy. I was raised on Jiffy. I do the Jiffy. And, and uh, y'all like mayonnaise or Miracle Whip? Mayo. Yeah. Miracle Whip. Exactly. Miracle Whip. It's, it's, it's the it's shit. Not, nah, well, I was not, raised on Miracle Whip. I, I, I fuck with Miracle Whip. Miracle Whip. That's, that's why I like you. That's what I'm talking about. That's nasty. Uh, Don't be hating. Uh, uh, like what? Always sugar on the sandwich. I got a question for y'all. I saw you putting sugar on grits. Yeah. 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 He, What's wrong with that? Where you see that at? Real man really 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 put sugar on grits. Nah. You eat no. sugar on grits? Hell the fuck yeah. With some eggs? Wow. Yeah. Shit. Sugar go on grits. Yeah, sugar don't go on I, grits. I can do salt and pepper too, but do you sugar go on grits. grits. Uh, I don't put it on there. Thank I put you. it on my rice. Yeah, I can put sugar on my rice when I was a kid too. She don't eat grits. I don't eat grits. But if you did, you would put sugar on them. It like tastes better with butter. You know what? Nah, that shit good. That shit go. That shit go. <laughs> Hello. Shout out to Von Trap. Trap. Watching so. Trap was guest last week. Hey, uh, Trap. Wow, we had it. So, when did y'all meet and decide to... It was crazy. <laughs> yeah. yeah, give us, give us so a So, we was at this show, and she had just got off the stage, and I was like, I see something in her. And then she was like, she sees something in me. Mm-hmm. And then no, I didn't know that we had seen something in each other. Right. And I was like, you know me, I'm a lesbian. I'm like, she's seen something uh-huh. in me. Uh-huh. She was talking about some business shit. Now, is that the proper like, term? That's what really happened. No, I mean the proper term. Lesbian? Because I don't be knowing what Oh, yes, what for me, say, lesbian. So. Okay. Let's be honest. Because some people be like, you be like, let's be, let's be. I'm like, what, what? I'm not trying to offend no, I'm, no I'm damn body. Me. I'm just like, shit. That's the term for me. Pussy. Okay. Uh, pussy like pussy. Mm-hmm. So I thought this was a pussy that likes some pussy. Cause, oh, But okay. that wasn't what it was. She said, you know. But you, you know, those are the best type of partnerships when you come together on some complete misunderstanding. Because then when y'all do finally understand each other, y'all on a level already. Yes, I wasn't really looking for a pussy. I was looking for a pussy. Oh, hand off my knee. Oh, okay. <laughs> so now we had, uh, got off the stage and then we both was just. Where were you guys at? We were in Hayward at this, like, uh, shout out to uh, Urban Peace Movement. Uh huh. And. Uh, uh-huh. Man, man, and man, 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 shout out to them. And Tamika. Because they, they booked shout me for the Tameka. last minute. You heard the Urban Peace Movement before? I've heard the Urban Peace Movement. Yeah, yeah, I heard they that. Do I mean, I've seen it like on people like, oh, uh-huh. we're going to be performing mm-hmm. here on social yeah. media, but other than that, I don't know too They much booked about me it. for the last, at the last minute. Me too. I got oh, booked you did? at the last minute. So too. then we just met each other. She had performed, and then I performed. And I was like, God told me to tell you something like you. You really great. And was this sincere like, or was you just mad? Yeah, she was sincere. She said, she said, so God, God was speaking to you. God does speak to me. Okay. Regardless to the how I look. Won't she do it? She said, spiritual. God told me to tell you that it's some people that you're going to have to leave behind. And I said, that's crazy because mm-hmm. I just started dismissing hella people. Mm-hmm. And I was doing the same thing at the same time. Look at the universe. And she said, God told me to tell you to not, what you say? Something about your relationship. Yeah, like you being picking the wrong people or something. Yeah. Shit. Mm-hmm. However, we ended up being stuck to glue ever since. Mm-hmm. She had a, a radio I, I, thing. I, Come uh, interview, up and... uh, interview on the uh, FM radio. You know DJ Luke? No. In uh, Vallejo? Luke, he a producer, okay. yeah. His radio uh, station was in Vallejo. But mm-hmm. I was like, I got this interview. I was like, you want to come with me? I just seen that she was about her business. That's what's up. And I was like, ooh, I'm about my business too. So y'all got right in sync mm-hmm. and hit the ground running. Yeah. Yeah, we just be and we we complimenting each other. Mm-hmm. But I think we was both manifesting each other because this we was like up. saying, yeah. we need somebody to take it serious, mm-hmm. hold each other accountable, not let each other be lazy. That's what mm-hmm. I was saying to the right. universe. And then I met Dre. Mm-hmm. And then Dre must have been saying the same thing. Because mm-hmm. Well, I had um, initially started the podcast with someone else. It was just called Sipping Tea. Mm-hmm. And um, it didn't work out. So then when I met her, me and her kept it going. And we would do like... Um, on site like podcasts like mm-hmm. at Denny's or wherever we was yeah, at yeah right. we, would, we would just go places and sit and park and eat and just talk about stuff well, and then um, out the car, huh? Saint I was telling you about Saint earlier uh-huh. for Aces um, he had saw me at small stages. Y'all heard of small stages before? I heard that. With I heard Dwayne, that. With Dwayne, with Dwayne Wiggins. That. And Tom Slick. Yeah, yeah Tom oh, okay. Slick. Tom yeah. Slick from mm-hmm. the, my favorite group, Sofa <laughs> Yeah, Tight. Right, exactly. Now say it all together fast. Sofa, Sofa Teen Tight. Uh-huh. Sofa Teen Tight. So um, 
Saint had seen me perform, like I had went to the small stages. I saw it on Instagram mm -hmm. and they was having the competition. I was like, oh, let me get up in this or whatever. And then I had performed this song called um, Cruising. And uh, Dwayne Wiggins had gave me a 9.5 out of 10 for the mm -hmm. song. And I was like, Was okay. it the old school cruising or original? It's original. I wrote okay. it. I write my own music and stuff. Yeah. yeah so, um, but anyway, so I guess Saint had seen me there and he was like, uh, he had a podcast and he wanted me to come over. Mm -hmm. Come on. And then the pandemic happened. So, no, wait, what's this guy's over. name? Saint. Uh, Saint for Aces. Saint. Okay. Christopher. First I ain't going to tell you what I thought you were saying. He in, the, uh, he in the company. I thought you were saying Satan. Oh, no. Satan, <laughs> Satan uh, uh, in. Uh, uh, and I'm no. sitting there like, uh, whoo, uh, these uh, new uh, niggas uh, nowadays uh, with these uh, names. But oh, Saint, no. I rock with and you, he's Saint. Older. He's an older guy. I thought you was, I, I, this whole time I thought you were talking about Satan did this, hey, Satan nah, did that. Nah, and I'm nah, like, nah, 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 I'm nah, like, nah, I don't know if I'm signing contracts with a dude. Nah. Hey, Satan. Nah, Hey, I'm Pharaoh. Nice to meet you. How you doing, sir? Good to see you. Nice to meet you, too. Yeah, welcome. So um, he ended up putting us on the podcast at Bay Life with Igor. Yeah. Um, Shout out to Igor. Shout Bates. out to Igor. That's what it do. That's my what guy. It Mr. What it do. Deuces. So I had went on That's there my by daddy. myself. I was hella nervous. Igor was feeding me all that uh, mud water tea. Oh, yeah. The mud water? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shout out to the mud water. I was in there stuck. The mud water. But I was like, hey, I got a uh, my business partner. She a comedian. I was like, I think y'all gonna love her. Mm -hmm. And then um, she came on there and they freaking loved her. Well, DJ already knew me because he yeah. had started seeing me in a couple clubs mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. performing with Bump, R.I.P. Bump. Y'all know yeah, who Bump is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bump. So he had already been doing a lot of gigs with him, seeing me, and then so me and him made a connection. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, this is your studio. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So fun. then um, we ended up. Um, We've been there merging into years, our so. own podcast, Sipping Tea with Sugar and Spice. Yeah, it's okay. been like two, almost three. It'll be That's three crazy. years in January, I think. Three years in January. Yeah, yeah. Sure. we still trying to get the flow of everything, you know, and because mm -hmm. we was fresh doing this it's media wild, podcast yeah, stuff, like mm -hmm. it was new for us. So mm -hmm. we still trying to figure it out or whatever. That's what's up. Like, Y'all be like us, you go live. So that yeah. Yeah. live is is real, It's raw. None of that it's scripted right shit, none right. of that. Cut, take, and edit the shit. Mm -hmm. It's like we live. If somebody fuck up, we just fuck up. Right. Yeah, that's both. we wanted to do that. At least once per episode, I put my foot in my mouth, and it's okay. Yeah, we wanted to. <laughs> I feel like we make history <laughs> when it's live. you know, I, I, his his comments are the only his. <laughs> <laughs> they don't reflect. They don't belong to you. They don't reflect me. <laughs> right. That's how me and her. Me and her. My shit to only do. reflects me. Y'all compliment If I offend other, you, though. so mm -hmm. fucking what? You guys are business partners as well, right? Do anything. Yeah, but we don't boo boo and stuff. Yeah, well, yeah, we don't yeah, wipe yeah. each other and shit. No. She do that. Well, that <laughs> she changed my diaper a few times. Yeah, 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 Pull my yeah. tampon well, out. No, I, got, I got somebody to do yeah, all that yeah, shit when I get home. Now do that. Yeah. Well, you always the funny one in the class and school coming I've up. I've been funny all my life, yeah. Okay. But I didn't think I was going to be no comedian. Mm -hmm. I was a booster. I thought I was. I wasn't nowhere near. Oh, you got to make ends meet. Yeah, That's but I didn't think correct. comedian was going to be it. I didn't think. Mm -hmm. The world got away. I just was always funny. Yeah. But yeah. I wasn't trying to be a comedian. So I was like, mm -hmm. okay, you funny, but what else? I mean, you know, I didn't think. I mean, you got to do something to support, like boost. Boosting and comedy That's is. That's all I thought is, was I was a booster. Boosting and comedy, though, so is kind Thomas. of the same line. You got to be able to lie to people, play the role. Shout out to my cousin Thomas. You know, and then, the you home? know, like for instance, so he's saying comedy, comedy and drug dealers is. He said, love you. You know? Love you too. Listen, for me, I started off stealing. Yeah. All I knew was stealing. I didn't know. I started me. off wrong, right. but then I got right. Pretty much. <laughs> you know, I've been through a lot of shit, like my daughter passing and all of that. Oh, and so, and those. for me, it Strength. was like, when mm -hmm. I learned that I was funny mm -hmm. from other people in jail, mm -hmm. I kind of just ran with that and was like, can't nobody take that from me. Yeah. You know, but it, it was... It was never that I was going to be a comedian, ever. Mm -hmm. And people kept with, telling me. Did you boost with finesse? And all? Cause I remember I one time I, ran, I, met this, and I, met this, I met this crew of people. Shout out to Juliet. And, uh, <laughs> Juliet and they <laughs> thing was, her name. and they thing yeah. was, <laughs> and they thing was, oh, uh, we do all this boosting, right? So one time I came with them on this boosting, and they boosting was, Grab the whole fucking rack. That used to be me. <laughs> so you know, so you sitting in the car and you and think they, they gonna come. come out with some tough for nah. and they come out with the whole fucking rack, dive in the car yeah. with the people on their heels. Now you got a high speed from fucking Hayward to Whoa, fucking. Yeah. Well, I've been to all those boosters. 
I done got left, boost in. I done took the U-Haul the boost. I done took the U-Haul the boost. Yeah, took too many. <laughs> took too many You was people. with her? No, a few times. Oh, oh shit, look, this is really good. A U-Haul the right. boost. That meant you came to put in work. We, that means we filling that motherfucker up. They trying yes. to get <laughs> I done got slammed down in the mall, you feel me? You even taking some of the people with you. Yeah, like, come yeah. on, fuck it. You like, got you a new job. Like, you stole the actual person. Like, and then you get there, you tell them, now your now. job now is to take the, uh, I've been left. the tags off. I've yeah. been left at the mall. Hell you work time. for me now. Somebody just sold me a shirt with a tag on it, and I could not get that fucking tag off of nothing. I just you gotta that shit. No, Mom, I'm okay, that shit's still sitting across my couch with this big ass sensor on it. Oh, we got you. Don't worry about it. Put a little bag on it. I got a uh, thing with a sensor on it too, but I didn't steal it though. You probably I didn't. to take it off. I, I told her we should go I steal to fund our career right now. No, nah, no. Nah, we try to do it. You can't go to jail no more. You can't go to jail no more. You can't go to jail no more. I said, ain't that a bitch? Oh, yeah, Bullshit. Don't fall for that bullshit. I was just trying to do it the right way. I was trying to do it right now. I tell her to do it the right way. No, you tell me. No. I still sell all kinds of drugs to fund my shit. I'm ready to go steal, but she don't Hey, it's okay. We if, all they indict me, if they indict me off this, then they was already on my line. We get a little chills. <laughs> <laughs> if, if they indict me off of this, I, it was already. Like Cass, like, like, Cass be like, blood, don't talk on the you phone. Nigga, I, if we to I, that point, it's I already a I push the button to go across the crosswalk now. I don't, you know, I push the button to go across the crosswalk. It's already too late. I don't fuck around, man. You already worried, man. If you're doing it so much that you're worried about talking on the phone, I drop a quarter in the motherfucker when they doing the march of dime and shit. You know, I used to call home on the ghetto call. Hey, put some money on my, put some money on my book. <laughs> Trying to get, you know, the call. Right. Yeah, they be like, who is this call from? Motherfucker, put that money back. Don't play with me, bitch. Right. <laughs> Don't you owe me money? Yeah, that's how we used to get a call. Hey, we call you, have, call. you have a, a, a collect <laughs> call from. You motherfucker, you think I'm playing? Hey, bitch, you're your motherfucking phone, bitch. Hey, everybody be cracking up like, hey, they hella mad you ain't in. In the pen now, you can call for free and shit. Right. What that nigga gonna do? He ain't gonna do nothing. My nephew in Oklahoma pen and every time he I gotta, I gotta drop money to accept the call. Oh, it's oh, only in yeah. California. Only in California then. No, oh, no my good. nephew in Oklahoma and oh, it's ten. Well. California. Out my ass to talk well, to him California. About nephew, <laughs> oh, nephew, come home safe, nephew, uh, so you can stop hitting money. Get on call, right. nephew. Right, my right, but, nephew but, at home in two thousand fifty. Right. Oh, oh shit! Oh, no. You ain't gonna have hol- telephones. They gonna have holograms. You ain't gonna have holograms. <laughs> hey, nephew, what's up, nigga? Y'all can do your secret handshake and some shit. <laughs> hey, what does 2050 really look like for us? But, Are we gonna be here? But good news, my That's son will be home in 2029. It was 2034. Oh, he got five damn. years off, so he'll be home in 2029. Where is it right now? Valentine, what's Three happening, bro? For real? <laughs> hey, hey. Yeah. And it'll be 2029 before we know it. Hey, VT, for real. Hey, Val. Can somebody pour my troubles? You gotta pour your own troubles. Dang, you don't wanna be a gentleman? Val T for real, though. Just a little bit. He started eye fucking you. 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 Me and Val oh, yeah. T have done three movies Fun. together. And uh-huh. Val T, holla at me about number four in two weeks. I love Val T. <laughs> uh, oh, your church living uh, over there? It's okay. Tom, Don't worry Thomas about it. Thomas said he's it's trying good. to make us a TV series. Yeah, Thomas, so shout out to Thomas. He's been talking about that for a long time. Hey, Tom- Thomas. Yeah, Sorry, brother. I signed him uh. in the parking lot. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wait a minute. In the that's my cousin. Look, so, wait a minute. That's my cousin. It's all we already signed. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Family be fucking over family. That shit. What's that, Jerry McGuire? So, is you still going to sign? Actually, you signed with dude an hour ago. Hey, Thomas is actually is writing us a. A TV pilot right now. That's what's up. If That's y'all my ain't guy. seen that Rose Go, go watch yeah, that. Yeah, and Rose, Rose Go yeah. 2 coming out. Real, 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 hey, I, you know, to... Fluffy Lives Matter, man. Look, you know what I'm saying? I was trying <laughs> to nice get guys finish last. You know what I'm saying? The characters in Put there. your I boy on. No stripper. Why not? Yeah. It's already yeah, written. That's right. You already in the movie the bedroom too. Only. But you in the movie right now. What movie you in? Uh, oh yeah, what something you? else with Slick Tom. Tom Slick. Yeah. <laughs> Good lord. I believe every woman should play a strip in a movie at least. Uh, she's ratchet. They got me playing the man. 
Ooh, a they always want to put me in those scenes. Why they want to do? I'm in a music video and I'm still in somebody's bed. I give you 44 reasons wall. why. Them titties. We don't need. We don't need it. <laughs> the titties <laughs> and them thighs. Yeah. I mean, I'm guilty of that. I've been writing scripts and this and my say, "Can I be in the movie?" And I'll be like, "Yeah, hold on, I gotta rewrite something." <laughs> yeah. I walked up into a movie one time and they were like, "Give me a boss." I got anti crackhead. You could be a ball stripper. A boss. Stripper. <laughs> a ball stripper. <laughs> they want you to cut your titties. Uh, Men don't see nothing but your titties. They don't. Like but you nah, Your they titties don't. will get you in the dough, but it'll be your talent that keep, keep you there. there. Mm-hmm. Well, definitely so, the talent know, kept me in the dough because they said no to my tummy. Oh. They was like, "Bitch, you big." As fuck. I said, "What the talent speaks for?" Right. <laughs> we got a whole bunch of life. Fluffy lies matter. Yeah. Now you got a big role in something else, though. She got a whole bunch of lines in something else. I couldn't remember half of them. I had to go line for line. <laughs> it be like that sometimes. We'll fix it, it in like the that. editing. What's the other movie that you was in? Yeah, tell me. Well, Jay Rich. Shout out to Jay Rich. That's the homie. Shout, shout out, out to homie Jay Rich. Rich. I don't know what the movie's called, so don't sue me. But oh. he does. <laughs> Hit him up. Little Jay you. Rich. Shout out to Jay Rich. I have a little Jay Tinder Rich, date or some shit on there or something. I'll be in a couple Jay of Rich things. is a pretty hilarious fellow. He's doing he some big things right now. I've been watching yeah, he is. him. He's moving around. Yeah, he got a show coming up in Seattle uh, coming up. Hey, okay. I actually got a show coming up in uh, North, what was it, North Carolina? South Carolina, yeah, we got oh, a show coming up out there. Is, is, wow, is, is any South Carolina right left? I mean, after the... Oh, I don't, I don't know. know. Just was. You don't be performing at a park bench. I have a show in Seattle. I have a show in San Diego. I have a show in San Diego. I have a show in San Diego. I don't know, whatever. South Carolina. That shit hit somewhere. I know it was... What was it? I uh, think it was the part Carolina the got the, the the what you call it mineral deposits that all this shit is about. Oh, you you'll, you'll get this. Th- you'll get this at three in the morning. I'm about to give y'all the ism. You know why that shit lithium. happened? Yeah, the lithium. You know, it's it's like the niggas in Black Panther have vibranium. So yeah. the shit that's over there that's in the ground is why shit get wiped out. You know what I'm saying? When you wanna when you wanna pull pull your shit out, you know, and don't get flagged. You gotta make some shit happen historically. Evident on some monstrous uh, shit. So then, when you come through with the bulldozers, it's like, oh no, they're rebuilding. No motherfucker, uh, you're stripping. And I ain't talking about at the, the Snoopy Fox. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Three in the morning. But oh, my mustache coming off. <laughs> I went to the Snoopy Fox one time. What, uh, you know what, what is Auntie D? He said Auntie D, the urban That's version the of Uncle wrote. Buck. <laughs> okay. Let's do it. He said, "Let's do it." Mm. All good. good. Yeah, you already familiar with this. AJ Time just, in the building. Hey, AJ just, Time. Hello. Oh, how was that? Oh, you Thank you for tuning Everybody in. Appreciate you. Everybody right now. Danielle watching. TK What's up? Drummer girl. How you get? How you get on? Oh, you went on there. TK Kirkland and Tommy G's tonight. Yeah. Oh, for real? Who's that? With a CK comedy. Is you a comedian? I've seen you somewhere. Oh shit! Oh yeah. Like, he I said, oh, shit. He no. says money. I can't do that huh? shit. I can't remember them lines. Is DJ Stokes going to be there? Canadian. You don't got to remember the lines. You just got to be you. I don't remember a line. It's the personality. I am, do not remember a line. Yeah, see, I can't freestyle. I can't freestyle. Just be yourself. Be if I be like, let me suck your dick after this. You know, freestyle. Because right, you kind of cute. I'm thinking about sucking you. Can we have a baby? Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be on welfare. I'm going to be on welfare. We have to be on welfare. He's on welfare. welfare over there. No, I'm going to be on welfare. Oh, yeah. Hello. Yeah, you do right. I told you he'd be jumping out of here at this time. I don't even like me, but I'll take him around the corner. Okay. I don't even like boys. I dozed off and woke back up. So... So, we, y'all show is on Bay Life Radio. Uh-huh. What days can they find you? Every Monday from twelve to two, doing what we do. You feel me? We're not gonna be there this Monday, though. We not because I got doctor's appointment. Yeah. So no, it's she, Indigenous yeah. People Day Monday. Oh, who? Yeah, well, it used to be with the the Pilgrims used to call it Christopher uh-huh. Columbus Day. But well, we, we definitely fuck don't with fuck with him. So That's they they call it Indigenous yeah. People's Day now. Indigenous people day. Yeah. Which basically means the Moors, the melanated people who was here before yeah. everybody. But y'all want to call it what you want to fucking call it, but whatever. So it's Columbus Day. Off. That's all I care about. But yeah, okay. we still, I ain't off. I'm at work. <laughs> I got we, work. Should, we still would have had, uh, we still probably would have had podcasts. Though. Oh, yeah. Unless mm-hmm. DJ had something to do on Columbus. Right, Columbus that's the only time we don't, but... We both got to take care of our health. What's happening, my guy? Yeah, I got to work. Yeah, I work. It ain't a holiday for me. 
Period. I work for a multi million dollar corporation. And we still we won't get that. We won't get that. Uh, for the uh, what is it? Fall break. Yeah, fall break. When they start doing that, I don't even look at that. No fall shit. break. They That's what they got right now? now. Where? Who? My son just was on fall break. But see, do he go to? He must. Fall 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 he got a no, he, he, he in a he in a I'm public a school. For you. Really? Beautiful. Yeah. Okay. Because <laughs> so, I'm trying to complete three more movies before the end of this year. Okay. okay so where are some of the Make movies sure that we, we can find? Are you on YouTube? I mean, TV. Hey, I'm I'm strictly open for. Okay, I want to watch. I am the I love Tubi. I'm trying to get on bring TV. the fat guys like back into the movie. In fact, back big we Luther. Just, in fact, we just signed the contract. Okay. I'm bringing and Big Luther the to all the movie sets. Written, which is the number one actress on Tubi, and she'll be here November 2nd. Oh, yeah. Oh, that, is that the Detroit oh, Girl? Yeah. Yes. And that, that's yes. the one that's on Rose Gold. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh, I love her. Crystal the Doll is Crystal. Rose Gold. Okay. Crystal. I mean, I think McKeegan might be in Rose Gold McKeegan as well. McKeegan is the other one. Is mm -hmm. that the one I think I see her in that yeah. movie? Uh, Crystal, in all the Crystal movies. Crystal the Doll is they number really, one and number they two. Really, I see them in uh, every I movie. I know, I feel like why every single movie on there. It might be. Because they say good. I think they started too. Oh, Tiff at the door. Oh, they started it? Yeah, get the Tiff at the door. Get the dough, if you don't mind, Flash. Oh, wow. I don't have my hair now. See, this we live, y'all. Yeah, what movie is it? Let's see. My number one movie on there was actually a religious movie. Basketball 360. Well, that's my favorite movie on there, but the movie that... I did the most damage that went all around the world was a movie called oh, Her Rose Leather Coat. Too. Her Leather Coat? Mm -hmm. We're going to have to get a list because I really she? am a Tubi. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. We got like a bunch a, of movies on there. On Tubi, on No, it's, it's, it's a wild Peacock. story. <laughs> we, got, got, we got shit on she a bunch a of shit. Then I got uh, My Sister's Keeper. Yeah. I got uh, My Sister's Keeper. I, I think I just seen that. that on yeah. TV. Oh, you wrote that? Yeah. yeah. And okay. then uh, we got, uh, Oh, no, no, I think I just seen it on the wall. Uh -huh. And then you see some shit. of the other movies we've done. My we Sister's one with Keeper was really good. Yes, we did. Hi. Hey. How you doing, baby? Fine. How you doing, baby? Uh, yeah, it's me. So, I'm doing right, baby. You so pretty. <laughs> You're so pretty. So I, have, so I have two movies on Hulu, seven movies on Tubi, and five movies on Peacock. You gotta yeah. say, what's okay. the names of them, though? I mean, you know. We're gonna get put the his name in there. I ain't, I ain't even gonna it. lie. I was so trying to get rich mm. that most of my shit was geared towards the mainstream. Mm. And now that I'm rich, kinda. Mm -hmm. sure. Town Bill on uh, Town Biz. That was our very first our movie. First movie. Is, that is that the one Val T in? That's the one Val T in. Mario and him is putting it on uh, You wasn't in Town Biz. You was in Town Biz. Yeah. No, Town Biz already on Tubi. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. In fact, y'all can see him oh, running down the street with an AR-15 killing people. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, now, he got to kill people in the movie. Oh, yeah. I killed people in the movie. Yeah. 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 Now, how you might wonder, how can you get killed three times right. in the movie? Okay, one time I got killed. And then somebody didn't show up, so they said, blood, we're going to shoot you from the back and kill you in this one. And then another one, just put on this different outfit. So I got killed three times in town biz. Right, three do, different characters. Stretch the talent, man. Stretch the talent. <laughs> and I was in the fourth scene. Remember at the strip club? Oh. I, felt, hey, I got that, so drunk hey. in the chair that they couldn't move me. I was asleep. This was real life? Yeah, so they just kept yeah, shooting. So you see me, even though I just got killed right. the other scene, I'm in the background. We like did, <laughs> for that strip club scene, we yeah. was at uh, Pink Diamonds in Frisco. We was oh. in there over, oh, okay. overnight. That was the worst uh, mistake of my that, life. We was missing that oh. shit. Man, yeah. Hey. Oh, my God. Hey. I was like, no, nah, I'm real going to go home. Go home. We was in that motherfucker overnight. Like, oh, my God. We went there. It was dark. We came out. It was the afternoon. Hey, Niggas Val, looking like Val, gremlins. Like Val, Val T was Val a killer up in there too. We Val was in that motherfucker overnight, and it was yeah, it was fun. I went out like a sucker all through the movie. That you wrote, right? <laughs> no, I didn't write the. Yeah, I wrote fun. that one. I uh, went all. I was. So how long does it take to write a movie? Because I want to write my own. I wrote a book. If I told you, you think I was lying? Like a year, yeah. right? No, the other niggas take a year. How long for you? If you gave me an idea right now, I could have a script for you Monday. Good. I got an idea. I got an idea. I'm gonna better stop cheating on Thomas. Uh, yeah. Thomas know what's up. He loved me. Thomas should be able to write fast. This shit. Oh, back in do. 2007, Lucky Thomas was writing Lucky movies. He Lucky. wrote that uh, Scraper Boys back in the days. Yeah. Thomas be writing all type of shit. Yeah, Tom, hey, Tom, we need you back on here again, though. Yeah. Girl. I mean, it's, we I mean, look it up. like this. You know, whenever somebody asks you, what's your gift? I'm going to tell y'all. In this world, as an OG nigga, your gift is 
Whatever you do the best with the least amount of effort. Mm. That's something that you gifted at. Mm. And me, me, I can literally sit here tonight, format the story in my head, sit down tomorrow, write it, and on Sunday, I'll go through it and proofread it and reformat it, and on Monday, I can hand you a 75-page script. Wow. What if the thing that you best at doing is sex? Yeah, sex. Okay. That's what she said. That's what, what you best at, huh? I didn't say me. I'm just saying. What I got a question. I mean, you maybe you need at? to get maybe then a person, not necessarily porno, but maybe get into okay. something. I was thinking about getting into porno. That. I was yeah. just getting into porno with my friend. Shout out to Jay from uh, Clear Music. Like I'm gonna be a stripper. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna be she about to do OnlyFans and stuff. Uh, yeah, uh, why not? We I mean, gotta get to the back. I seen Linnell on said OnlyFans. Hello? Oh, well, yeah. wait. I didn't see Linnell. I heard oh, okay. the last I, 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 I seen her on Red Monkey uh, and Lunel, um, uh, 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 OnlyFans. Shout out to Lunell. I thought about doing OnlyFans. She had that pussy yeah. outside. Okay? I can't. She threw it up in the circle. If she can throw that motherfucker up, I know I can. Be what I wanna be. If you ever wanna know if the rent is doing or not, when I saw Linnell on OnlyFans, I was like, okay, the oh, rent yeah, is I'm too. Like, <laughs> I forgot I was Y'all play too much. Oh, yeah, I wasn't throwing nothing. <laughs> there. Unfortunately, there's a lane for everybody. <laughs> hey, shout out, to, shout out, shout out, out to Linnell. <laughs> oh, no, Linnell's, the, that's the homie. Shout out to Linnell. Get yes, your money, girl. Man. She's she been on the set here. She done came a whole long way, you know. Because there's a market for everything. Like, you going more, like, going, like, one day I was curious. So I went on point her. I was like, I love porn. Hub. So I typed in midget. Before I could finish midgets, it it already filled in, which meant that there was, and then there was like seven thousand. So that meant there was other people who have searched for midgets. Because I, I was like, because one day I was sitting, I'm drunk, right? I'm drunk, and I'm sitting there like, no, no. And people have already looked for it on there, and it's a subject, it's a category. So I'm like. You know what, I want to just be like midgets getting it in. So, like, midget. And then there was hella, hella uh, videos, right? And right. then I was like, but then I started thinking, the man, if I was like to die right now, right. and somebody come and see my search history, <laughs> then I'd be like, whoa, <laughs> this nigga was a wild boy. So I ended up clear deleting, your cookies, nigga. So I ended up deleting hella shit. Clear <laughs> your cookies, so guess what I do, So guess what I looked up? Animation <laughs> boy. Oh, and that, that shit turned shit. me on. It was like, bad, bad pussy. Ooh, that, that sound oh, you just yeah. made, is that something? That sound you just made, is that something you'd like to share with the class? Huh? Yeah. She liked the class. What did I do? You said, ooh, like, ooh, if like, y'all only knew. No. <laughs> like, no. What you been searching for? Let me for? tell her this. First of all, I don't be searching. Let me tell you I don't right be searching for nothing. Let me tell her this. Stuff be popping up. No. It just know it reads your mind. Like, no, you know. You got the Google so you know, glasses, no, you know or it just be you like. Those mm-hmm. apps. You know, you know when you get those today. apps to see the free movies and stuff like that. Oh, uh-huh. And when you be scrolling, it probably, when it be down it here, they be down here. Let like, me ask y'all. Why are you trying to make me watch hey, this? Big dick, dick, dick. That ad to be like niggas in your area and want to date. I got the Japanese. I the Japanese animated stuff. Clicked on it. I didn't. I didn't. I got a question. Right. Like you let me run. They be like. Like muchachos. Yes. I got a question. Muchachos is in your daddy. <laughs> Come y'all down. The computer got got you. shut down so many pop ups. Yeah. Like, yeah. Y'all so hella stupid. That's a wrap. You're like, go <laughs> see hey, me. That's the beauty of living Besides in America. Your... <laughs> and we was in yeah, Iran yeah. or something. Girls and take us out and do something. I'm proud to say Man. this motherfucker right here ain't never seen no porn. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't fuck around. I make porn. I don't search for porn. I make porn. Okay. Okay. Brand new. No I got a question though. No I got, I got a question device. for the guys. <laughs> you right. He is I mean, other shit I use. And how do y'all? Because if I thought I was crashing in a car wreck, I, I hate smash the man, this so motherfucker. <laughs> My last so you, act on earth will be to smash this motherfucker right here. <laughs> 28 and how old are you? This motherfucker connected to my heartbeat. You when it ended, it blow up. I got a question. 26 and 48. Mm-hmm. Is y'all climbing through the window with a kitty cat to, oh, to get some pussy? I climbing have. through the window? I yeah, no, we can now at this age. Oh, hell no. At this age? Uh-huh, I know somebody that 247 do. pounds. I'm, I'm, I'm adventurous, but... Climbing through the window. I'm adventurous, but... Climbing through the window? Uh-huh, because you don't want to stop. Wait a minute, no. You just said to get what? To get some dick. I know, I know, I know. I drop go. dick off. See, I don't go pick at dick our up. Age, <laughs> at our age, the better question yeah. is, have you ever had to climb out of a window? <laughs> I, I thought you said that nigga wasn't coming home. 
Yeah, we talk about climbing in the window and out. I mean, that, that, don't get me wrong. It's just adrenaline rush. <laughs> Would you do it right now? Some, I, I know somebody that do it. That's what I'm trying to tell you. know somebody that do it or has that climb, That does it all the time. That climb hey, it I mean, it's adrenaline rush. It's a mindset. So, you know that but y'all taboo 48. forbidden shit. You got to keep it sexy, Stop bitch. Stop saying it. My stepbrother yeah, step is 51. Yeah, my step like, hey, we at work. Play. He's like, nigga, come bring Hey, my stepbrother step step is 51. Motherfucker, bring your ass in the cocky room real quick. He was somewhere where he was supposed to be. The person called, and she said, I need you to stop calling here, my man here right now. And 17 minutes later, the door flew off the hinges. The next nigga was there with a gun. He socked partner and took off running. Now, this is the part that y- that y'all probably is not grasping. Yeah, playing with your life. He jumped out of bed, naked, socked partner. So now he's running down the street, naked. Dick swinging, probably. And partner's Maybe. chasing him with the gun. Partner trips and falls. He gets around the corner. He gets away. You mad and he get off and hit you in your ass shit? Crack yeah, back uh, uh, just mad you get scraped on your shit. Car keys, clothes, and everything is back at the nigga house. Niggas out there just running from the Another nigga come outside and just... said, blood, I don't know what you're going through right now, and threw him a coat. And he put the coat on, and then somebody nigga, shoot, else came out and gave him some sweatpants. And he, had to get, and he had to catch an Uber home and, sweat and come back the next day to get his car keys, his clothes, and all that shit. He's my so yeah, we see. I don't fuck around. We, we big older niggas. We ain't climbing through windows. I used to do that shit when I was young. But ain't no nigga immune from having to climb out of a window. I know somebody right now that's 42 climbing through windows. Nah, I can't do it. First of all, I can't do it. With a cheetah suit on, like, girl. I can't do it. That's sexy. That's Catwoman. In the window? At 39, maybe, but when you hit 40, y'all gotta go to the Marriott. Y'all gotta go to the Marriott. Stop putting age on me. Y'all gotta go to the Marriott. Don't get mad at me, because me and my nigga like to do spontaneous Watch your knee. Nah, you gotta go Look, put a motherfucker on. Oh, shit. What? Oh, oh shit. Put that shit up. Uh huh, yeah. Shit. You know what I'm saying? You yeah. <laughs> okay. gotta cry out of shit. What the hell? <laughs> yeah. No, you gotta go, you gotta go to the Marriott. Look, we yeah. gonna, we gonna do whatever we want, wherever we want, whenever well, we want. Well, she climbing in the mama. Because I'm y'all gonna run with that. Oh, no. Adventurous well, is First adventurous. of all, stop telling my business. Because you know, he's probably them, watching put, right now. I told y'all I'm gonna put y'all on one of them lists. Tell her to stop coming to my house at 6 in the morning telling me her business. You, they gonna put uh, you on one of them lists. What list? You know them lists. <laughs> oh, we were spontaneous, and now you, and now you on the, and now you on the list, and you can't even get a hundred feet of elevator. See, but okay. I wasn't naked. So though, we so going there? Okay. So I had clothes on. Question. She said she keep on looking at me. Question. Come here, Tiffany. So, oh, she want to rub on it? Come here, you want to rub on so, it? So, so climbing out of windows, like, <laughs> playground shit, the monkey bars <laughs> session down the slide. I got a bad rotator cuff. I can't do all that well. You know, I just had that procedure on my shoulder. I got shoulder, a bad I still 26. Where's hold the bitch upside huh? down. But you ain't you say what the scenario is yeah. with yeah. what you climbing through the window with for. With some dick. I told no, you. I know, but why you climbing through the window? And she don't want to talk to the mama. She's taking notes. She don't want to talk to the mama. Not to hide. Shit. I'm not to hide. She just don't want to talk to the mama because the mama don't know how to talk to me. The mama is going to keep me talking for hours. And I'm yeah. trying to get you know, some dick. It's like I'm here. Hey, look, I'm here. I'm here for what I'm here for. And I'm out. That's nothing wrong with that. I respect that. It's like, look, motherfucker, I'm here for a good time. Not a long time. I'm here for a good time. Exactly. Not a long time. No, it could be long because depending on how you do. It might be long. Right? Is, I'm here somebody for a said good I'm time. here taking notes. I'm not here. That's Miss Sexy. There you go. Yeah, that's Miss Sexy. That's the homie. Uh, she yeah, said she's like, taking notes. She get yeah, you know what I'm saying? It's classes and sessions. If you know what you're doing, it don't hello. take all day. All you gotta do is say hello. <laughs> uh, no, definitely. Forty seven. When, when, when you walk into the front door and that's where mom's is sleeping at, so you waking her up out of her. Yeah, seat, you don't want to be disrespectful. Like, look, I'm coming to fucking shit. You don't know how to say hey. I'm like, I'm gonna mama. walk by her dad when I'm like, nigga, I'm gonna beat your daughter shit up, the nigga. Right. And he yeah. looking at me like, nigga, what you here for? I'm like, nigga, what you think, nigga? <laughs> It'll be the middle of the nigga, night. Hey, look, nigga, here go a bottle. Nigga, shut the fuck up. I think mom's gonna have a conversation, though. You no, I talk to her when necessary, but sometimes, you know, I just... Be you don't know how to say anything. Hey, in and out. Bad. Exactly, like the burger. Smash. In and out. <laughs> It'd be like the grandma. Come on, you still here like a bitch. <laughs> I can't. Hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. Y'all is crazy. Right, you got Salute. it. Oh, shit. It. This is a good interview. This is funny. So... 
<laughs> it's, wild as fuck. Yeah, because it's, it's finna be fall. Well, it's fall now, and we're gonna get in the winter. It's cuddle season. It definitely it is. is. I'm gonna have fall when it's just what, five days ago it was 100 fucking degrees. That's yeah, what I'm, I'm gonna die in the heat. It's supposed to rain in a couple of days. That's, that's I'm gonna die in the heat, bro. It's 40 that's when you're supposed to get it in. I'm fresh out of the house, That week, the weeks when it was hot, that's you're supposed to get it in, build up your cardio. It's supposed to. That's what's it. That's how you do it. Okay, got to. I was working uh, in the damn game. Man, I almost died in that heat the other day. You got to push the, the brink of death. I was like, and they was giving it I guess God wants me still here. I don't know. Like, yeah, this yeah, cool. Cool. I mean, I guess mission. you do. You got, you got yeah, I said, because I'm going to some work pack. left to do. Yeah, I'm on a sleep pack, right? And so, uh, so I'd be delirious and shit at night, like all over the place. Then your sleep pack isn't so, working. No, and she it don't broke. be on it. Yeah. So, it broke, yeah, so God it. sits me yeah. up like this here. Because you're you supposed to wake it. up like this off the seat pad right. like right. Yeah, you got to use it. Can you see a brand new day? It's still delirious. Yeah, you need that. Now she wake up like this. Use it. Right, I wake up like, why are y'all talking to me? Use it. I'm still asleep. That's me all day. Yeah, I wake up cranky. I might be like, dude, I want to ace, baby. And then I'll be like, motherfucker, if you don't get the fuck away from me. Don't think I'm too early. Why? Why do you wake up angry? I don't wake up angry. I wake up not want to be fucked with. Don't talk to me yet. I wake up in sections. I'm fat. I'm home low. I'm strong. I wake up in sections. I wake up like this. I actually start a fight. Yeah. I wake up slow. I wake up and don't be. Yeah, I wake up and I don't wake up and want to have a whole. Give a fucking. I don't wake up want to have a fucking dissertation. I wake up like. I wake up and this nigga talking to me. I'm like, I'm not woke yet. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, exactly. I be like, dude. Not you. I'm talking about my girlfriend. She be but but that's for a warning to you. Oh, no, don't wait, don't talk to him first. Up. First thing in the morning. Oh, she she, she having a fucking committee meeting. That's oh, family. Yeah. She know she what time it is. She having a staff meeting. Oh, <laughs> hey, no, I'll oh, be having a whole God. conversation. She having a staff meeting. I'm not going to work tomorrow. Right. This bitch be on the side of the bed. They having a whole conversation. But she be sleep. I be thinking I'm sleep. I don't know. I don't know. Stop it. Like, Mark said, no lock like, doors. Man. No lock <laughs> doors. But God she, keep waking she, me up. She be dreaming about that fucking porn search. She, she, she yeah. be looking up. <laughs> Animation <laughs> porn, y'all. Yeah, she be looking like, like anime. Give me my money. <laughs> all you, <laughs> all you <laughs> get. <laughs> I'm drunk as fuck. Give me my money. <laughs> I, my money. <laughs> I like we done drunk the whole Remember, bottle. Remember, you supposed to be watching your liquid intake. You were supposed to be watching my liquid Me? You are my drink. brother's keeper? Mm -mm. I didn't drink all of that. Yes, you did. Mm -mm. We sipping. So, if you Mark, what's up? Hey, bro. And, and tuning in. My guy all the way in London tuning in. So, what's hey, happening? My guy, what's up, London? Sure. Tap in. What's happening? Make sure y'all follow us on all platforms. Yeah, tell, uh, tell, tell everybody where they can find y'all at on social media. Canary yeah. underscore. No, no, no. no Canary no, no. hella funny. No. Canary hella funny. <laughs> <laughs> they took my social media, y'all. At the Andre and Nicole. The Instagram took my shit. I was popular. Yeah, she hit me. Nicole, she's she's pretty popular too. She is. The one on Poor Minds. Oh, who? Poor Minds. She's Dre and Nicole. What is she? An actress? No, she's a podcaster. Oh, they got that podcast, Poor Minds. And her name is Dre and Nicole. This nigga, all right. This nigga Anthony said he said he in London at the club right now. We're hella bad African baddies. Yeah. He got brought the baby oil with him. Hey, I no. hey he said, hey, he wants your FaceTime. Uh, no, no, uh, I'm not no, participating not, in your FaceTime uh, shenanigans. Hit me, Nick. I, I might answer, nigga. I might. He said, Maybe. Great show as usual. No. Oh, yeah, we got Appreciate you. I'm, I'm glad, glad that y'all have this on here. Now, do y'all have guests on y'all podcast? What's y'all format? What's y'all format? We just come on and play games and Like, what are y'all primarily. We do the same thing. Yeah. Same thing you do, but we got like a game wheel on there. We play games. We doing like freestyle raps. We mm -hmm. we got like the Bean Boozle game. So um, keep you know. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> that was aggressive. <laughs> All I hear is. <laughs> yeah, we just be on there having fun and stuff. Now, we've seen. I see the funny. Mm -hmm. I see the flow. I see the ism. Ism. Mm -hmm. Can I get a note though from you? Her. Yeah. Why I knew that they was gonna do this to me? Because I just you, didn't I just tell you I got out the hospital. Today. Did you get out the hospital for a lung condition? No. I got a, a, a sinuses and ear. 
So nothing that affects your lungs. You gotta see the ear, nose, and throat. So nothing that affects your lungs. Okay. Nothing that affects your lungs. What y'all wanna hear? Whatever. Whatever's on your heart. Let me see. Share with y'all. Hey y'all. Oh, oh, we gonna hold on. Hold on. Let's get this going. Here comes the moment. Right on the set. I need this. Let me see. Okay. So I wrote a song. Um, in honor of my dad. I like it. Here, here you go. Um, yes. <laughs> hold on. Let me get myself together. Yeah, yeah, bring it in. Okay. How do that song start? I, don't I can't know. even it's think right now. Y'all got me fuck? off all this cognac. Like, no, no. <laughs> this that moment I in church where they say, take your, take your time. Take your time. Okay, so take I, your time. I'm, I'm going to start over and I'm going to do, um, I'm going to do Miami. Okay, so I'm going to start off. They say <laughs> that beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Oh, the motherfucker with the act. But the definition of beauty. <laughs> Go. The definition of beauty mm -hmm. is. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what is happening? I can't think if of If you was going to get signed, you words? She's trying, yeah, I'm like, she's trying to do it brown that sugar and shit. I'm like, get into it. Get into it. The definition of beauty is the story. Come on. Okay. We all ears and shit. I'm looking in the mirror light. Okay. I wish my ass was a little bit bigger. Psych. But maybe this waist, you could snatch it into place. Tight, cause that's what they like. <laughs> Ain't that what y'all like? See, you need a small waist, a big booty, a cute face, and that's the perception of grace. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I like that. But like this image that you chase, it seems to be so fake, but you just want to be great. So you keep on. Yeah. Y'all okay. doing she a lot. She remember her song. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I couldn't. What the oh, fuck was going like on? That. That's what she was getting signed today. She was like, I got it's all good. these things going on, and then y'all feeding me this look up. With all seriousness? <laughs> no, that was not. I, I like hear, that. I can hear the talent. Thank you. I yeah, I'm trying to, uh, when I met her, she was singing testimony. My beard coming off. Y'all can go. Y'all can go uh, oh, listen to my music everywhere. Oh, that's right. what I was going to say. Are you on iTunes? Uh, I'm everywhere. iTunes, YouTube, you Spotify, um, Apple Music. Z Dre and Nicole. T H E E. Yeah. Andrea we are Nicole. Over here, yeah, them is her real titties. <laughs> they say they got a question. Is them your real titties? Definitely. Like baby bottles. Here, baby. We, don't do <laughs> we tried to be I ain't, had no, I ain't had no lifts, no tucks, no, no. nothing. <laughs> they said that was good. So Thank you. Got a song I'm trying to get on the bat. I do got a song called Dollar Bill. Okay. Was can y'all see Where's her on the song that you were just singing? Uh, Miami. Hold on, because I got two <laughs> different. Uh, I'm trying to get her on the baddies. No, I don't like them shows when they got the sisters on there fighting and shit. You might not. I ain't with all that. I'm not going on baddies. You might not be fighting. I'm not with all that. I need y'all to be. Maybe I can fight. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't like. I need y'all to be fighting. Maybe I can fight. I don't Oh, hurry up and get I want to hear, I want to buy that song that you just sing it. We it? own it. We support people. What is this song? Is this we don't be pump faking over here. That's cool. I'm trying That's to call cool. it. We fucking with y'all. We fucking with y'all. We like, what's happening? Now y'all locked in. Ain't no switching up. Oh, we, we good. It's like, y'all show is, t what time is y'all show? 12 to 2. Every Monday. Every Monday, 12 to 2. And then if we can't make it, it's every, every, every other Monday. We got it. Usually it's every Monday. And they can find y'all at Monday. So Day Life come Radio. On, I'm not pulling Y'all come on our show. That's I, crazy. I got, a, I got a real job. So Not a real job. This is a real <laughs> No, I, I be at work in the day. So remember you here, I was told, I was like, man, I be at work. I, I know we to... need to switch our time because everybody be nah, at work. No, no, you don't. You, you, you make it work. Well, we can y'all take a Monday off? I can't. You ask. Okay. It's not popping up. I don't know why. Testimony I, popping up. Yeah, you want me to take a whole vacation day to? That's not a whole. Vacation day. Not a whole vacation. A whole vacation day. That's crazy. Uh, no, but but in my, I, I make it happen. Miami. There you go. I'm committed. I make, make it happen. happen. Then we'll we'll make it happen. Just be late. Mm -mm. Can Tiffology come too? I don't do late. Tiff. <laughs> 
Yeah, she can time, time is the only thing currency. Yeah, Niggas pay yeah, cash yeah. for shit, but everything costs time. To the, you know, call, Not to a bank robbery. To a bank Inviting you to a crime. She like, like, well, I'm coming to. I, I ain't confessing. Yeah. Yeah. I need a lawyer. When, when, so we gave it's up? It's usually every Monday, oh, no, he, 12 um, or 2. I think he probably goes to. And Bay Life Radio. Oh, okay. Yeah, Bay Life Radio with Igor. Yeah, on 94. Yeah. Oh, you got a video for that testimony. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's not popping up on yours neither. We got some shows coming up at Tommy T's too. So what's up? Plug that yeah. shit. Let's talk about it. So me and Dre and, and the DJ are actually... <coughs> DJ Igor, my guy. I talked in my country. Where Igor at tonight too? I, should, I don't know where Igor is. He's doing something tonight, I'm sure. Different things because I'm pretty I just sure he is. With a label. But yeah, we're going to be coming busy. up with a so show. I got my, and we're my music that I release on my own and then I got my music But we be doing a lot of shit. I see you did a song with Kiki Latrice. What's that? Kiki Latrice. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, we did a song with Pimp Styles. You know Pimp Styles? Pimp Styles. No. What's that? Spartacus. Spartacus. Kiki Latrice. Kiki Latrice has been on the show. Big Dot. Play the song for them real quick. Big Y'all want to hear Booty? Big we just dropped Booty uh, not too long ago. We no got diddy. on that song on some fluke shit. No Diddy. No Diddy, booty. right. Yeah, it's just called Booty. It's called, called Booty. booty. Call it Yam. I think they putting a little extra on that Diddy shit. Man, That's they right. said he killed. Yeah, no, okay, let's talk about, about it. Sorry, they no. Oh, y'all want, they y'all want to talk about They talk about Diddy done killed Tupac, Biggie, his daughters. He mm-hmm. done did it all. Man, that's Jaguar Wright. Man. Jaguar Wright got on there and said, and said, oh, Jay-Z know killed Big L. First off, if you anywhere near the industry, you know who actually killed Big L and that they, in fact, got killed and returned. It had nothing to do with Jay-Z. So that ruins her credibility. Right. Then she was on there with Orlando Brown, and Orlando Brown oh, said the Orlando. woman wrote Orlando. The Matrix. This woman was yeah, five years old when The Matrix came with Jaguar Wright. And I'm sitting there like, you got, yeah, you two, you got two fucking nuts sitting here agreeing, right. and then this niggas on Twitter. Uh-huh. But that's all The, the for truth is being clicks. revealed. No, I'm like, ain't no truth being revealed. This this is maniac shit. This is all no, likes and clicks, you, have. you know? So. But I'm saying, but there's people running across the country saying, this man is you guilty. What if the man Jay-Z didn't do all that? Jay-Z and did this and did that, that, that based on the word of a fucking nut. What if he didn't have all that breast milk and baby bottles? Hold on, what if he didn't? He got a thing. It's no crime to have baby oil. Or breast milk. Back in the day when I had the, I had the old school water bed, I used to put baby oil on it. Let me tell you something. What was he doing with the baby oil? It's fine. Well, you know he rich. He can get a lot of baby oil. You get it by the shit. I ain't put my glasses on. Well, okay. With you niggas. Let's say, <laughs> let's say I'm, the I'm, liquor. I know P. Diddy ain't in the store pushing the shopping cart, right? Definitely. So not. he sent me his assistant, right? I, I go to Smart and Final Iris hey, to get this. You go to Costco. Right, or, or either nigga, one. You know, it's going to be a whole pallet of the shit. Right. So I'm a cop. Why like, I need to send somebody when I can just point, click, and shift, and the shit is at my door? No, nah, Diddy old school. Diddy I don't like need nobody to go get that shit. He probably yeah, send yeah, a nigga, no, you go get me cheesecake, you go get me baby yeah, oil. However, the nigga, he made me not want to get in the industry. Yeah, I said, you know what? Fuck that. Can I go in on and say some real shit, though? Go ahead. What? Okay. If you ever been... Partying with anybody that's got any type of motion. I'm talking about from the streets, the Real music motion. business, or something. I'm talking about motion, which means which means that it's people that's gonna be in the room that's got names, that's got power, that's got money. In any type of scenario like that, mm-hmm. if you, sometimes you gotta go to these parties to show your face, right? Mm-hmm. But you know, at a certain oh, time, now, like Cat Williams said, you gotta break out. I have been, I party with a lot of politicians, right? Okay. But at a certain point, you knew it was time to go home. Because at a certain point, I'm there's gonna be all of a sudden strippers is about to show up. Niggas is about to bring out the plates of coke and all that type of shit. If you ain't with none of that shit, but the assumption is if you stay, because you the type of nigga don't take the hint to leave, then now it's niggas. It's a married nigga over here who got a prestigious reputation, and he got. Two strippers sitting on his face and snorting coke. If you see that shit, then he's going to expect you to do the same. Right? I got a question. So if niggas, so all these people talking about what they saw, you ain't see all that shit if you wasn't participating. My thing is this. I go right. from this My thing is this. this. A lot of these people, <laughs> a lot of these people be saying, hey, I would have left the P. Diddy party. Hey, 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 h
<laughs> What's happening, man? Like, you yeah. got uh, do right, yeah. Me show you right, nigga. This nigga. show you right. But what was you saying? <laughs> I was saying this. Listen, right now, before P Diddy got. Before P. Diddy got put yeah. up in the jail and all of that shit. Uh, if he would have invited me to a party, I would have went. It's P. Diddy. Yeah, nigga, yeah, nigga, yeah, nigga, yeah, nigga somewhere. Yeah, but the thing was, that nigga somewhere doing that jumping jacks with a butt plug. Two too. levels of party. Like, right, there's going to be a party. Like, for instance, on this level of the party, hell, fucking Aretha Franklin is over here. I would have said was P. Diddy. Aretha Franklin's over here. You know Aretha Franklin ain't getting it in. She was getting it in. In her day, but I'm just saying, though, is you're going to have a party down here, right? You're going to have Aretha Franklin over there. You got Jesse Jackson over here. This is that, right? Everybody you saying got skeletons in their closet. Yeah, they all used to get it in back in the days, but now I'm talking about they're 60 and 70 years old. They might be at the party, but then there's another party going on upstairs. I'm going upstairs. They not in that party. Party. I'm going upstairs. Okay. Only because it's P. Diddy. No, I'm cool. Come no, on, now. Everybody let's, be lying. I okay. ain't going upstairs. I'm going upstairs. Let's keep it. Let's keep it. Let's keep it 100. Okay. Right hey, now. Hey, hey. Right now, as so, Durak and Diddy Dre and Nicole might go upstairs. But if you got seven million in your account, you got eleven water, million in your account. You ain't got to impress this nigga. You ain't going upstairs. The right? edge water, you want to? The edge Unless water, I want to. Right. The edge now, water on steroids. If I had eleven million in my account, I don't think I would have to. Diddy party is basically exactly. the edge water on uh, steroids. <laughs> yeah. yeah, if we are the Kelly too. Power exchange on steroids. I got a question though. Do y'all feel like P Diddy and even with the R Kelly scandal, uh -huh. it's something else going on that like it's something to distract us. Of so course. P Diddy got all this distract thing us going, from what? The real shit that's really going on. It's some real shit going on. Of course, it's all a distraction. What? But we don't know thing. what. It's all America a distraction. Got, something going on America behind America got this 370 this. million people. Miss Sexy, right? uh, R. Kelly has some of the million the, of his white people who really don't R. know. R. Kelly who the made fuck some of the greatest fuck, guy is. fuck tapes in the world. Right. I just feel like. Know. I'm talking about the oh, music. Oh, you mean the music? Oh, yeah. That's R. Not, Kelly? That's not I my got, first song. He's been molested. R. Kelly molested us. I've, 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 man. R. Kelly molested us through the music. 12 point of my song. I don't give a damn. Really was born but there's a but in regards to R. Kelly. In the the 90s, I separate the man from the music. In the 90s when I was only 10. He feel talented. In the, in the I, 90s. I was doing three days in high school to R. Kelly. Hey, but see, there's another aspect of R. Kelly. You get that. I literally had about four of my closest friends literally died, 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 got murdered, took off this earth unnecessarily. I'm in a deep depression. And I wish. I'm literally out there starting shit with motherfuckers because I'm ready to. Because he on hammer mode. I'm ready. I'm ready to. No, I'm ready to go too. He ready. So my he, friends, he, he ready to crash out. Love is gone. Mm -hmm. He's ready and to crash out. And somebody played that song for me. I wish. I know. I believe oh. I can fly. Mm. Oh, yeah. I I, oh, that's right. And he fly. saved you. And literally, and I had that thing on on a on a cassette that was on it was on both sides, right? Mm -hmm. And sometimes I would sit in my house, and I would literally play that shit for hours. Mm. And you know, the baby mama be like, "You need to get some help, nigga." In fact, if you don't go get some that help, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. You know, True. and all that shit. But uh, so I tell anybody. I, kept, I never listened to the the love maker songs, but between I, I, I wish and uh, uh, between I, I wish and I believe I can fly, fly. Sorry. but I believe I can fly. Yeah, literally, seems like literally lifted me out of depression because I was like, because I was too scared to kill myself. Right. So I was going out trying to create situations where somebody would kill, kill me. Well, I know. And then that way I wouldn't look like I went out sad because I didn't want everybody I like this nigga kill himself. I didn't want to go out that, but I didn't want to live. So I, I was literally doing that we go wild like shit fuck. to make somebody else kill me because then it would be respectable. So yeah. then, he was on so then, up. so he I was listened, on so up. I listened to R. Kelly. It lifted me yeah, out of this depression. Why is you tickling my leg? I That's got my life together, you. right? So now, all these years later, they saying R. Kelly did all these horrible things. We got to put him in prison, and I'm sitting there like, no, how bad nigga. a nigga? Could, like, okay, he did some sexual deviant shit, right? But this nigga He's really saved. This nigga saved my life. First door go after the That's water how we go First door on the left. That's how it be with us. Music is just right. like comedy. It. Music is therapy. True. I had somebody music say that my music helped them I'm get sorry. through the stuff right. that they R. going Kelly through. I'm sorry. R. Kelly can piss on me. She said okay. R. Kelly. <laughs> 
said, I'm Miss sorry. Sex, okay, that, that's the homie. She, he yeah. said, Here's the thing. I'm, I'm, I, I, I feel it. I, 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 on her. Saying, uh, uh, Here's the thing. Know, I'm going to say this. Uh, there's, we was trying, if you know, you know, I'm trying to give him the ism without giving y'all the ism tell you mm-hmm. too much. I'm a deep ass nigga. Like so it. I'm going to go there. So, but here's the thing. In cartoons, they showed you music tames a savage beast. There's parallels and notes and hurts. Mm-hmm. So all that shit is paramount to mood, sets, tone, mm-hmm. perspective. Everything plays a part. It's, it's a symphony. The waves. Vibrations. It's the sound vibrations. Waves. vibrations, exactly. Mm-hmm. Vibrations. It's the reason the rose sells. The rose? Mm-hmm. The rose, the toy? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. Right. Listen. Oh, I love that mother. I'm going. Look, you get this at three in the morning. <laughs> Almost fucking fucking. But I'm just saying. I'm, I'm, I'm putting the... I'm 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 over speaking and I'm giving it to right y'all there. in the latest time. I love time. that motherfucker. It's world. a dangerous yeah. piece of work. I had that <laughs> motherfucker on my pussy last night. Yo, you know what I'm saying? That's just vibrations. Why would Frequency. you say the rose of all things? Frequency. Now I'm because horny. I'm I'm, I'm I, 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 tell, I I tell shit like it is. Me too. You know. It, now I'm, I'm just horny. speaking. I'm, I'm just speaking for real. <laughs> You're music tames a savage beast. Remember, we watched we watched Looney Tunes. Remember Bugs Bunny and had to fight with the orange and hairy motherfucker. And the, remember oh, who, when we was uh, kids, the, the motherfucker with the hair looked like a wisdom tooth. The wildest. You know I'm going oh, there. The tooth that looked like a wisdom tooth. The orange, the hairy orange motherfucker <laughs> that used to chase uh, Bugs Bunny. Hold on to my Lord's sake. <laughs> not, yeah, the road, you better not, stop. not the road runner. No, talking about, uh, I'm not talking about Wally e. Coyote. The, the Bugs Bunny crazy. had beef. It was a the orange motherfucker. He was hairy. He was shaped like a wisdom tooth. Yeah. Not a wisdom tooth. Yes, it was. Huh? Everything is given to you for a reason. I'm, yeah, you, I'm feeding you right now. Uh, I'm you need definitely is. I watch Looney Tunes. I mean, Looney Tunes? Tunes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I remember. I drunk as fuck. They Looney played Tunes. music and it tamed the savage beast. I'm going to have to look that up because I don't remember it. that motherfucker. Yeah. I remember Tweety. All them, but. Donald Duck. The orange haired motherfucker that shaped like a wisdom tooth. It was after. And he played music, and he he would, mm, but that's parallel to life. Mm-hmm. When you look at Sonic. when I play, well, I'm talking about with R. Kelly, all these motherfuckers who Create music is a motherfucker. Even in that book that a lot of people believe in, with Caesar Borgia on the cover, that you know y'all the motherfuckers be praying to the motherfucker that don't exist. But um, <laughs> remember the, the I'm demon over because if the light didn't come, I want to only hit you. I am the light, so <laughs> why should I be? A, <laughs> If I'm the light, why should I be scared of myself? Period. You get that at three in the morning. Uh-huh. <laughs> but uh-huh. here's the thing. Uh-huh. Hey, y'all remember that man at four in the morning? He's like, cause God. With yeah, that green, um, BT. Yeah, yeah. He wake you up every night. At four cause, in the cause I'm up at three, so he already had an hour to learn my yes. shit. So he tried to change the uh-huh. That nigga used to creep into your dreams, cause you be dreaming him. and you hear that nigga, you wake up here's like, the what the fuck? Cause God. Remember, here's think about it. You know that's the dude the game. They even tell you reverendness. They tell you that that Satan used to be watching the angel of music. He was. That's what they tell you. He was the closest one to God. They say he was the most beautiful angel. So what tames the savage beast is music. Yeah. Music touches your soul, touches your chords. It touches you in 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 all the places places it needs to touch you. Touch my body, rub me on the floor. Music, exactly. Music touches you in all those places. Music can inspire every emotion. Ooh. Anger, sadness. It gets you through a lot of shit. Happiness. Music can touch. Mm I mean, grab a hold of mm. every emotion that the human body can emit. I'm going to go write a song. Three in the morning shit right here. <laughs> you a songwriter too? I'm, I'm a rapper. You feel me? Comedian. I do it all. She, I'm a got, I mean, she got music. I mean, she got music. When you, you understand that. I mean, we got music. I can't know when, when you understand that, that music <laughs> touches every parallel, every frequency of human body. Mm. Why are you in the morning? Hugh, three in the morning. Uh, two, teach me. Teach me how to dug Hugh, three in the morning. You got to catch it. Come on, let's show them what we got. Come on. If I you slow down, down for you to catch up. No, we're doing our handshake. We don't That's have one of those. Yes, we do. Uh, but Dougie, didn't he die? Let me show you. Yeah. Boop, boop, but boop, human boop, music boop, touches boop. everything. 
Because it's meant to. It touches you. You're parallel. Your cords. What's your Frequency. Sound? I'm a Sagittarius. Top of the man, oh, okay. bottom of the horse. Sagittarius. And anybody that thinks he's kicking Everybody, nonsense, frequencies and, and you sound waves know. and it's, stuff I, it's like that. It's that three really in the morning can. shit. It really do. And everything emits a frequency. Mm-hmm. Human everything. beings, this microphone, everything. Some could be that miserable, but Mars. I'm not Jones. I love AMS Mars. A lot of people don't realize, too, that's why, like, FM radio is like... That's why all frequency. music got converted from the, analog like, to the CDs the and the shit you listen to now. Because... The what frequencies you? that you listen to your music now, it mm. speaks to you differently. You don't get the analog because it, it, back in the days when the albums, you know, yeah. now, when you put the needle on and get the, uh-huh. you hella funny. You get that. I'm looking at the back. All that shit speaks to mm-hmm. you. And he be here every week with you, motherfuckers. And you said, "Nice to meet you." <laughs> <laughs> we been, we was fucking yeah. We that's so us. We, we weird. Yeah, I, fucking we're, me. We're, I even caught that. Yeah, we're, we're being like asshole. Hour hey, 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 the drag just gets yeah, yeah, we been right, late. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Right. One, one, the reason why she more people she got that at But the reason why more people don't know about frequencies and stuff like that is because people call it different things. But no matter whether you call it, if you call it energy uh-huh. if you call it Thank vibes you. if you call it frequency when you really break it down we all talking about the, the same, same thing, thing. when yeah. some people approach you some people are saying man i'm really that. feeling his energy mm-hmm. but some people yeah. be like oh i really was digging their vibe uh-huh. when you talk about vibes frequencies energy it's all those type same. of things is, we thing, just use yeah. a different terminology but when people um, realize it's all the same then you start realizing you, that there is you, something yeah because how you, you get know? it how you take it is how you learn this? you know my shit. conversation oh. run the nation procrastination is a violation mm. Mm. procrastinating mm. so assassinations mm. is illegal mm-hmm. what's up tim only like on Wednesday. But <laughs> when it Definitely comes to, on like we said, with here. you got you got the R. Kelly, you got the, you know, to the, the, the circle and bring this back around to what I was getting on. When you got all these geniuses of the art, because mm-hmm. everything is art. Hello. And you have these masters of the craft. I got a question when you're done. That, that get there. Because it's, mm-hmm. it's a thin line between genius and insanity. That's why I'm going to go ask I know you, you is. You know, I'm giving them the class. All genius, I told you y'all not giving each other. Is there, there's there's always a darkness. darkness to every genius. <laughs> Everything. A uh-huh. dark side. There's, there's a left and a right. You got to go through that darkness for you to you get to, to that genius. Like You cannot truly understand the power of the light if you don't. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Oh, it's a spider. Right here. Somebody right get here. it. It's a spider. A white one. Oh, not my drama juice. Is the white is the white one more <laughs> dangerous than the black one? The spider's know. like racist. <laughs> that motherfucker yeah. came out of nowhere. That was the devil. Keep going. You got that. I think the black like one. Like if I show up in a clan fit, you're gonna look at me I weird. The but if the white dude out there in the clan you, fit, you're gonna be you like gotta, who got the gun? The black one is the poisonous one. You yeah. have to understand. Oh, no, black one got poison. You gotta feed both wolves. I got a related question for both of y'all. Go for I it. I gotta ask. Okay. Now, we've said genius, as he's pointed out, genius has darkness, right? Mm-hmm. Now, we know a lot of singers, mm-hmm. like the R. Kelly's, even Mary J. Blige, mm-hmm. have said that they have had really dark periods of their life. Mm-hmm. Like, Left Eye, for instance, was always one of some, somebody's head, burned Don't down out violence. of violence. Mm-hmm. And a lot of comedians also suffer from, like, Pizza. depression. Yeah. Hell yeah, yeah. Like like abandonment. So abandonment, depression. You as a singer and you as a comedian, mm-hmm. what is your dark side mm. and how do you combat it? Mm. I'll be in depression all the time. I quit, I quit, I'm giving up. I'm done with this. And then her, she'll pull me out and be like, girl, you ain't done. So you, so it's your support system that brings you out. Yeah, because if I fall into a depression. Yeah, she definitely be needing support, a lot of support. Yeah. Because okay. she's so used to being abandoned. I, I learned so much from her, just meeting mm-hmm. her and understanding, like, all the things that she went through and, you know, that she endured and stuff like that. And it's like, dang, like, I understand why she that type of person, you know? Mm-hmm. I so, went from drugs to never thought I was going to be on drugs, to talk about people that was on drugs, from boosting to losing a child. That is... <sighs> to writing a book about it, okay. right? And so your support system... I didn't know how great I was. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Let's put it that way. I did not know when I walked into a room that I made other people happy. So there was a little bit right. of insecurity that you felt... It was that's not, 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 not knowing how It was like, how when you, you fit people? in the world. 
I, I didn't know where I fit. I was okay. just like, all I know is I'm good at stealing. That was from 12 to like 37. Just stop stealing, you know? Mm -hmm. So for me, it was like, damn, what you gonna do with your life? And then people kept telling me, hey, you got something. Yeah. So it was like taking a chance on yourself. And then when you That's dive the into the company, it. to the comedy, my son was my biggest fan, you know? Yeah. He still is. But then salute, I start seeing people. Salute to the young king. Yeah, people will use it against me now because they can't, because that's all they have for me right now. You They're like, oh, it. you know, you ain't even that funny now that I'm mad at you. But you was at every show before, right. you know. Yeah. So now that I'm mad, that you're mad at me. What's betrayal? Betrayal? What's betrayal? Mm -hmm. A lot of people. <laughs> Shit. A lack of loyalty. Bet bet betra lack. Betrayal is Human somebody, beings. betrayal can only happen to somebody who's close to you who, right. who, who felt and seen something in you. And, right, and felt know. a certain way after, envious later. It, be, it can't it come from somebody people. who never thought you wasn't shit. Right. right. It's crazy because it be those people that That's closest okay. to you. And I've lost a lot of people. It's okay. And I'm like, damn. I, I was like, yeah, I feel like God sometimes, because I'm very spiritual behind all of this. I'm very spiritual behind all this. Yeah, that's what but yeah, <laughs> God sometimes has to, to separate me. <laughs> he has to separate me to elevate me. Yes. And I understand that now. At first I was like... break you down to build you up. Yeah, but so and then I'm in the hospital, right? Because I was supposed to be on your show. I know, yeah. On the 27th, right. but I was you in the hospital. It. So I'm it. like, damn, God, okay. I'm in there playing spiritual. Won't well, she you know, do it? Won't he do it, right? Or won't whoever. Won't she do it? Just won't she do it, right? Whoever. <laughs> Whoever's doing it. Somebody's doing it. I better give and her I said, her props. you know what? Stop playing with her. <laughs> I said, God, you know, whatever it's supposed to be is going to be, you know. But they was like, you got all these. I went in there with one thing. Like, I needed a breathing treatment. Mm -hmm. And walked out with hella shit. But I remember asking God to lose weight, right? You got to mm -hmm. be careful when you say, hey, I want to lose weight. But you didn't say how you wanted to lose Thank weight. Thank you. So now, she don't say, oh, you want to do what? Yeah. So now I'm in the hospital. They're like, you got this heart condition. You got to you gotta be on this diet. Now you got to lose weight. I said, oh, God. Forced you to do it. Yeah, you but you asked for it, but I didn't go into detail. Don't complain about having a lot on your plate when you ask to eat. Right. That's hey, just like that, that's still, real shit. So you got my thing is you, you got to ask to be famous. You, you ask to be on TMZ. Yes, right. you got to go into say how. Yes. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> you got to break it down into detail. You how better you be, spe be specific. Not I don't want to be in the dark. For you not niggas perfect. that can't enunciate, not yeah. pussy. You yeah. need to be specific you gotta write it on down what you're asking for when you're asking her because for the shit that you need and the shit that you want. Because God has Where no you come from? dimension of the one we 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 the force of life. You see, we, yeah, we know the forty-seven points. We get there. And for you, Andrea, you you have a very soulful voice. Yeah. But like the most soulful singers, like the Mary J. Blige's, uh, even SZA, Summer mm. Walker, them types. They always have a lot of struggle in their personal mm. life. Mm. And I used to running yeah. joke used to be. Oh, when Mary was depressed, she made the greatest Don't album. The and then a couple of times she got happy, and she was obviously happy in life. People said, it wasn't, the music, it wasn't, the music wasn't good. So people was like, oh, I want depressed Mary. And I was like, 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 I was Mary J. Blige, Blige fans on earth, right? Mm -hmm. So music wise, I want depressed Mary, but life wise, I want Mary to be happy. Right, 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 right. right. Do you feel. Do you feel that you have to go through those changes to really reach your true greatness? I feel uh, like you do. I think just like life in general allows me to get in that type of space. Um, I think I, I feel like I create great music however I'm feeling mm -hmm. um, because my music is supposed to be healing music. It's just okay. to help people to get through stuff that mm -hmm. they're going through. A lot of times people think that they're going through stuff alone or that, you know, mm -hmm. nobody mm -hmm. else is with, you know, going through the same type of stuff that they they witnessed or whatever. But um, I feel like I'm like the voice that. Yeah, but sometimes, that, uh, like for instance, mm -hmm. Keisha Cole, the crying makeup mm -hmm. smear. Keisha Cole the old, got the great yeah. albums. Mm -hmm. Keisha Cole got happy, was grinning, and everybody was like, "Hey, hey. no, nah, we want you to be that going Miami through same shit we going through. I know, you can't I be happy, bitch. I think people relate more. Fuck, more. fuck these that niggas. My, that Miami That's some bullshit. Fuck that. People no, you relate fuck more when you going through something. They do. That Miami when you happy, they be like. That Miami song that I just sung for y'all, um, I really went to like a um, plastic surgeon and got like a 
consultation and all that other type of stuff because I was going to get some. Uh, no, 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 I didn't. I didn't. Okay. So um, with myself personally, I've gone through shit. life and I've done it myself. It's I've pressure. worked out, done everything and all of that. But, you know, a lot of times people want a quick fix. And with mm-hmm. everything that's going on right now, that's what it, that's the, the yeah. fad or whatever. You know, that's what everybody doing. They're looking for a quick fix. But it's more yes. of you got to love yourself and understand who you are, understand how God created you. Yes. You just got to understand who you are as an individual to know that you're not created like this person or that person. Um, you got different gifts in different types of ways. Yes. God created you in this manner to Thank inspire you. people in certain types Thank of ways. And, mm-hmm. and singing Miami was basically just a, a song to say, you know, Okay, we see all these things that's happening, but love yourself first at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? Like, stop worrying about how other people see other people. Worry about how you see yourself. Right. And so that's what's going to help you to be able to grow. So it's a myth that, oh. a, that an artist has to have their heart broken I think, to be able to tap I think that it is. I got some dope songs coming from Heartbreak. Yeah. Okay. I got some dope songs coming from Healing. Scars I, build character. It do. Like, if you don't go through stuff in life, then you can't build yourself. Like, you can can't be grow. A teacher if exactly. You Exactly. Experience uh, scars build character. That's exactly. one of the things I've always said. Scars build character. So unless I've been suspended or been in the trenches, you'll never know. I can I you can I can talk about it from the outside. Exactly. Mm-hmm. And then you'll have the oh man you ain't but let, what we say the hard headed got to feel it to believe it. Mm-hmm. So, so you have those people that's that's their destiny to go through the shit to come back and tell the people hey I gotta warn you. Right, exactly. Man, don't to go through this shit. When we was younger, you, your, your mom, your uncle, your auntie, somebody tell you, man, you, you, you fall in love in junior high. Man, there's plenty of fish in the sea. It's just, and we young as fuck. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? That, she like me. Motherfucker, she do my homework. She give me her pudding cup. It's all me. <laughs> I and, just had this. And, 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 and two weeks later, you like, man, she was giving my homie the Look, homework too. Behind and, your and back. niggas is mad. I'm just saying, nigga. I'm I'm sorry. She was giving me the homework and the chocolate milk and and the fruit cup and <laughs> elementary school. My bad. Whole but time. That's life, nigga. Suck it up, Buttercup. I but. was just uh, I was just talking to my son. My son, he just turned 23 on this on the seventh. But he been going through life, you know, and and just experiencing things. But I'm always talking to him, telling him. But now, what his thing was? Oh, mom, I'm young. I'm 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 having fun. I said, okay, you having fun, you young, you sitting up here trying to impress your friends, you coming out of pocket, you spending money. He liked to do donuts. He then went and got his car modified so he could freaking do donuts. But now stuff keep happening to his car, money, money, money out his pocket. Now he can't do the stuff that he want to do. I was like, I told you, like, I don't want to be sitting up here. I wish you would just listen to me so you wouldn't have to go through this. But Key words, I I wish you would listen listen. to me. Good luck on that. If you figure it out, write a book. It'll sound like crazy. Hindsight is twenty twenty. Man, but everything is a lesson. Some people just gotta learn the hard way. Unfortunately, and and and, and, and like you said, unfortunately, some people do, and and that's just some people. That's have. always stupid to me because here's the thing: it's time. easy to. I didn't have no parents, right? So I was always looking for that type of thing. So when anybody that was older or seemed like they knew what they was talking about, Mm -hmm. I was so good. I turned around and I tried to get my kids. And niggas be like, let me make my own mistakes. And I be like, you retarded motherfucker. I'm telling you, don't go around that corner because you're going to get your ass whooped. And I'm not telling you hypothetical. I went around that corner two, three times. So, blood, go that way. I ain't, I ain't talking to you about, I went around there and bat my head up against the wall. So, nigga, I'm telling you, it ain't cool around there if you want right. to be prosperous. Because here goes the thing. I always thought life was going to be like this. I took it to here. My sons would come and take it to here. Right. But instead, yeah. niggas want to get the ball from me here and then go back to the beginning and reinvent. And I'll be like, damn. You can't reinvent. Is my mama going to ever have doing? one generation of her kid? One ge- is there going to be one generation de- descended from my mother? Like I said, my nephew getting down 20, 50. Is there going to be one generation? I've been putting my one being like, is there going to be one generation of mm-hmm. our family tree yeah, of a nigga that ain't going to see jail? Right. That's going to listen to the, great. listen to wisdom and, and this and that. And I'll be like, damn, shit damn near hopeless. Man, I that's just, what I'll be like, trying to I got three listen. sons. I'll be trying to teach it's them that. It's not hopeless. It's just you got to, you just have to continue. Well, in my experience and my brother's experience, we give him, we fucked up, but we ain't had no parentals. Right. 
But we giving birth to well, niggas that's fucked up. And then the next generation after them is already they going to juvenile hall and this, that, the other. So I'm sitting there like, man, is we going to ever have one generation that's going to be free like, oh, she said, that's tell them you're going great. with them to do donuts. Like, Break the generational curses. You got to. They say. Because we. I thought I broke it, but then I got a few sons incarcerated. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, damn, did I really break it? I broke it for me, but then these niggas picked the It's the social ball. media and the internet, and they all... <laughs> Everybody needs to feel the, the need to be important. Exactly. And, yeah. It's like, it ain't you, it's them. Yeah, they don't well, like I've said here before, like, they're like, oh, we finna do this anti-violence, or we gonna do these type of things. You know, like, could you come and participate? And in the back of my mind, I'd be like... I can't be out here on some <laughs> anti-violence and I got a son that's a shooter. But that ain't on you, though. But I'm just but saying, you know, is that, that ain't on you. you're supposed you to understand. practice what you preach. But you that ain't on. So I'm going to be out here, y'all need to stop you're this, practicing. y'all need to do that, and, you and my him. son done murdered well, half a child Did you teach him that? It's not no, you. Huh? You got to teach him that? No, you did not. Exactly. Okay. So you, you can't can still, take that on. You can still be like anti-violence. But if you put a motherfucker to the world, who that goes out? Nothing who to goes do with out? You. That's he a grown ass man. At one point, if you put the motherfucker into the world, nah. who goes out and starts shooting out. people and killing that people and, and causing shit like and that? He jumped off the bridge. No, you so originated you. this nigga. I love my son. You mean you I mean that sometimes? That's why. Killer was in you. In 2025, the killer was in you and just went through your kid. Raw sex. Anything I did was before they was even born. Dangerous. Have you killed somebody? All sex has been dangerous forever. It has. Don't answer that. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. If you ain't right. went out there and smacked 99 niggas and your kid goes smack yeah, you, did it, it's different. But that's not you. It, you, you, you can't. Yeah, they're going to try you. Like, there's they a 2 do what percent chance. Do. Hey, guys, fellas, listen. I'm going to give you an ism. <laughs> fellas, listen to me. Like there's only a 2% chance you can get a pregnant woman pregnant when you fuck raw. So other than that, if she ain't pregnant, don't fuck raw. Right. No, for real. My thing is, you can still go out there. You get that I need, I need, I need more breakdown on that one. Yeah. <laughs> if I talk about hey, said, it's under, different. it's under a two percent chance to get a pregnant woman pregnant. It does happen. A pregnant right. woman pregnant. A pregnant. It pregnant. does happen. Pregnant woman they, I, I, hey, listen. Hey, listen. Listen what he's saying. Say it again. I know the human body well. Right. Yeah. I study. Okay. Look, he's still like I mean, I'm lost, man. I don't know if it's right. Right. Yeah, this nigga got a she cool got ass rhythm. Okay. Listen, he's saying it is. You know Ice Dog? I don't never know. Y'all know Ice Dog? I don't have all the answers, just the right ones. All I know is that if I raise my son up and I but, raise him up the best that I could, and then he go outside and kill what somebody, he after? what he did, what he got shit to do with me. I didn't no, raise people him. People will call you out. Yeah, yeah they will. That, but like, you can't control somebody else's boy. That's what people fail to understand. You can't control. You can't do the water, but you can't control. Nothing that talk. somebody else do. Because <laughs> I didn't been the, the, the freaking so just most strongest too, single mother mm-hmm. that I can for my three sons. Okay, but been the only one there for them, 100%. Mm-hmm. But my son, my oldest son, chose to take on the type of life that his dad mm-hmm. would be doing. You know what I'm saying? Okay. For whatever reason, you know, because it's a male figure, I guess he feel like that's the male figure that's closest to me. I got to follow in his footsteps or mm-hmm. something. It's undue pressure on, on yeah. melanated men. Don't say black because we're not black. You consider yourself a color, you've already lost. Put okay. yourself in the box with the Crayola, with the sh- Sharpie <laughs> shit. That's I Crayola. Niggas that, like niggas that identify as a color, that's where the fuck you belong. I'm right. sorry. I'm just telling you what it is. Same way the the, the, the the pilgrims call you the ER, nigga, that's what you are, ER. Right. I'm just saying, you, you put yourself in a box... Only thing in the boxes is for is for shoes and underground. Right. What's crazy is is I got three dis- different sons and they got three different directions. Like they all totally different. You know what I'm saying? Like my middle son, I don't know. He just more in his. He trying to figure out life type of situation and he trying little to find kid. himself. My oldest son, he about that money. My youngest son, he be putting himself in college courses and That's what's up. all of yeah, that. Because he's, he's watched. He 13. He so do that to himself. Yes, he do all of that stuff himself. I have he know what some of my frat do. brothers and whatnot. I, uh, let's let's connect. Mm-hmm. I, I, I will uh, connect Young King into some. I, I got yeah. I okay, oh, I let's do it because yeah. he definitely. I'm trying to make sure I get him into everything that he could. Yeah. That's gonna make my him son is 18. What can he get into? Everything. But see, your son does, I got some. It's know, never. Like it's hey. Let me say this. It's never too late. Like you. That's that's the definition of. 
he didn't follow behind your pussy. And he, too late. and he was raised never. Never. Uh, it's never too late. Me, oh, I don't watch your niggas do it. So yeah. I'm gonna do it. You feel me? Like right. putting his hands on me it's, on the shit. It's never too late to, to, make, to make some shit happen. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So if they trying like, to do some shit, head, I, 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 I know some people that that's about people trying to do shit, educate, move okay. people forward, and yeah. all that. So I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm trying always to find him all the programs that's going to make him successful. I, I, because I, 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 he can tap in, I can tap in with my resources and be like, hey. No, my son do it. He go, he get up in the morning, that's what's 7 up. o'clock in the morning, go to the basketball court, play basketball. He, uh, he outside playing sports. He doing whatever he wants to further himself with basketball because that's, that's what he want to do. He want to be a basketball player. Mm-hmm. Really like that. You're going to have a kid that's more I would say this when it comes to sports. Um, his teachers, when I, after I talked to like the staff at the school and had a conversation with them, they was like, oh, I see where he get that from. And that's my dad instilled that in me. That's you know what I'm saying? Salute. But, you know, his dad Salute is not dad. too shabby on certain type of stuff either. But, you know, I definitely influence him a lot because I'm the type of person who put in work. You know what I'm saying? Like, I go for whatever I want. Like, I'm not sitting up here doing something because somebody told me to. Or, you know, I'm doing it because I want to do it. And I'm going to make sure that I take all the necessary steps to do it. And that's how my son is. He started freaking talking at, like, 10 months. That's what's up. That's impressive. Yeah. That's what's up. So, I got a question for y'all. Okay. Where do you see yourself within a year? Like, where do y'all see the show going? I this see it show? going big and and doing a lot of big platforms. I see like, this show going Pornhub. Pornhub? Definitely. Yeah. Y'all be having <laughs> shoppers up in here? Yeah, yeah, I want to do That's a Pornhub. I'm trying, I'm trying to be the Howard Stern. That's interview porn star. star. I interview <laughs> for, I no, no, a porn star. No, actually, I'm just joking. I'm bullshit. I'm a porn star. I can star, see us. <laughs> I'll, I'll give you my, the, hold on. You can Honestly, say minimal words all night. What's going on? Yeah, Flodge, go ahead. I'll do. I'll be covered up. <laughs> go ahead, Flodge. Co- get, get, oh, y'all got a hero Where here. Hotel going? hero. Oh, yeah. That's my Jamil, brother. Jamil, that's my nigga. No, shit. Yeah. We, we I did here. the girls and girls with him. You'd be surprised who I... Never had on here. I didn't... I got a lit You have Big Twice on here? Yes. Well, hey. Twice was on here. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. I know you guys had um Angie. Angie? Yeah. Yeah. Angie, y'all. Y'all had Tamara the brand on here yet? Yes. yes. Well, that's my girl. I've been on, yes. I've been on okay. to your, your podcast. Little, not ours. Well, Who's not White the Outs? podcast, but the, uh, the studio. The studio. Yeah. Who, who podcast? Tamara. Y'all all got oh, to come to our podcast. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I've been to White Outs. And I've, I've been, been to White Outs. I've been, been on White Outs a few times. I, you, I, like I said, next week we got Eddie Projects. Eddie Penthouse next week. Okay. Brother Brosey coming again. Mm-hmm. I got... Uh, Angie and Tiff coming. We, we've been the hell of shit. Tiff says she's not going to talk. I know. Yeah, she's just going to sit there <laughs> like yeah. a mute. Mm-hmm. Tiff out there making she TikToks trying to play those no, games. No, no, that's Tiff. Tiff, 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 Tiff and that. Everybody on the We've show. had everybody. We've had Jay Stalin. We've had. Hey, we've had, I did the show with him. Uh, God, my God. What's his Mel's name? Mel's been here. We've had. I've had a hell of people. You had Louis Bell. So you guys opened no, up doors. No, I haven't had. Bro, you can open up doors for people, is what you're saying. We fuck. I, here's the thing, I'm gonna tell you. I don't do politics on bullshit. And religion. But anybody, I don't know if I, I, I talk about and everybody religion. because I know what I know. <laughs> so I talk shit. But <laughs> on the real <laughs> shit, I love just being able to come here. We sit down. We drink on here, but nobody has to drink. But let's talk about what you got going, right. what you doing. Doors open. Networking, Doors network open. determines your network. That's what I've always been. I'm not. I'm, I'm not. I'm not a gatekeeper. I okay. know there are gatekeepers, mm-hmm. but I'm always be a nigga from the Dubs murders 1900 all day. I feel like guys, but, but, and all the celebrities right now that's up there, up there, and making room for the people that's like us. Yeah. See, that's what we do in our podcast. It's we about support. Come, yeah. Yeah. yeah, I come and just say, "No, you hit me. You hit me. You said, hey, man, you folks. I said, what's happening? Yeah. It wasn't no." Let me see. I don't know. <laughs> like, it's good. We y'all right. want to come through. It's good. Right. That's the type of nigga I am. To be able to Newly build intelligent guy, gifted African. Spread Period. yourself everywhere. You know what I'm saying? That's Period. what nigga well, is. Well, me and Canary looking for some shows. We looking for some opportunities. So. What's happening? What type of opportunities? Um, yeah. Performances. Um, we want to get paid, y'all. We tired of doing shit for free. <laughs> we done did it for now, free. Now, we be putting in work. Like, I be doing stuff with, uh, you know, Antoine, uh, Mr. Funny, Mr. Special. That's his name, Mr. Special. Twine. Mm-hmm. Uh, what they what they call a uh, comedy thing? Bay Boys, a comedy. 
Yeah. Well, white, yeah, white out is with them. They yeah, are. We don't work with white out. Yeah, I've been I've been fooling with Twan for for years. Like when I yeah. first started performing, like big big out here, he was the one who was putting me on at his comedy mm-hmm. shows to open up for his comedy yeah. shows and stuff like that. So if you need a comedian, you know, a lot of shows out stuff. like in yeah. Fairfield and Vacaville and Fresno. Yeah, we, we network, we network with everybody. Place. When it's, I was doing it with him, it was like Alameda, Oakland mm-hmm. situations. Yeah, but. Yeah. He's been in the game for a cool minute. Mm-hmm. Funny brother. Shout out to him. Still yeah. my chest. That's the homie. Oh, oh hell She no. got the purple. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm over here. Feel it, baby. Feel it. Yeah. Yeah, you got, you got do rag yeah, in here tonight. <laughs> Y'all yeah, want me to get all sensual. Industry about perfect. to be open. That's right. true. That's right. Salute. <laughs> we now, what's your next show? Um, Tommy Keys. We got a sh- no. You got a show at Tommy T's. Oh, yeah. uh, November eleventh. I mean November tenth. I got a show at Tommy T's. Tommy T's. And okay. also, I got a show coming up in South Who Carolina. Who's up on the show? Uh, it's gonna be Concier Adonis. He be our uh, co-host too. Okay. Yeah, Jump sometimes. off Herb. Dugard usually does a birthday show around that time. Really? Shout out to the homie Dugard. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, it's going to be at Tommy T's. It's a day show, actually. On a Sunday? Okay. On a Sunday. And uh, we're trying to get people to, you know, if you're a Scorpio, we celebrate y'all birthday. Y'all start the party. Sagittarius in the party. Yeah, well, I ain't a Scorpio, but my girlfriend oh. is, so I'm going to throw her a party. Mm-hmm. Scorpios are the beginning freaks. The uh, uh, Shay Sugar gonna be on the bill. Shout out to Shay Sugar. I love her. She's I, so yeah. funny. I love her too. We've been, yeah, I've been trying to. Yeah, I gotta reach out to. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna make sure to tap in for you a little Adonis bit. Adonis <laughs> Concierge is actually throwing the show. He's a, he's a he's a funny guy. Everybody, y'all yeah. naming. I'm good. I'm good with. Hey, we we can we link up. Let's make it happen. Okay. I'm, I, like I said, I'm a nigga that don't do. I don't do the politics. I was watching y'all uh, show. Fuck I was like, with who it. Is fuck with it. Cognac Confessions. Okay. I've seen y'all uh, a few yeah. times. Yeah, I'm I was like, oh, okay. I'm, 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 I'm going to tell you this. I do what Suge should have did. I stay in the background. Only reason you know my face is because of this show. Okay. I, I sit in the background. Suge and... wasn't built for the background. Yeah. Should night? Yeah. Right. I'm, I'm um, should night, little brother, all night. Ask your bitch. Ask your bitch. Right out there, he should night. He should. He should white. No, he should. He should white. No, he should. Not. He should, white. No, he should not. I'm should night, Shug. little brother, all Shug night. Shug wasn't, Shug wasn't built for the background. Yeah, he I'm should night, rap, little brother. He was always all night out yeah. front. Ask your bitch. So, what do y'all love about this show, and what do y'all hate about it? How's she gonna come interview y'all on y'all own I, podcast? I don't know. That's good. Yeah, no, no, it's good. It's an open conversation. <laughs> I, she just went I, I, I let Phil. Y'all, y'all go. Y'all Where's take y'all it. Look, y'all, y'all take it. I end it all. Uh, <laughs> so my goal be like to get everybody like from this area to come through. So we've been having hundreds of guests so far. Like hundreds, probably got to be close to a thousand down okay. there, yeah. okay. if not more. Five so years just of this. having people come through mm-hmm. and just networking. like, yeah, yeah, networking and all the relationships that I done built and like all the shit we done What did. do you do besides this? He's the best rapper in the day. Oh, yeah. you do yeah. rapper? Yeah. You rap? Let me see my phone real quick. Reverse engineering. How can we, go ahead. How can we follow yeah. you? Let me go follow hey, this guy. Yeah. 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 Camouflage. 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 Yeah. This is new video. Yeah. Him, and, him and Jay Stout. Okay. Yeah, we, and we we'll, filmed we'll, that we'll, right here in this right parking lot. Yeah, we won't pretend. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah, well, I, def- I definitely ain't the best rapper in the Bay, but I fuck hey, with you, everybody. You are you. That's all you can be. Yep. It ain't about being the best rapper. I feel it's like about you, you being your I, authentic self. I feel like you're you. a good rapper when you get a chain. And I see you got a chain. So you <laughs> <laughs> That's you know your last name, real. Yeah, okay. Real, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna follow you. We we fucks around with you. Okay. So so now who's your favorite comedian? Together, That's so. what I said earlier. My favorite yeah. comedian. Once she starts singing, I'm like, I'm, yeah. I'm besides do rag and cool, can, can 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 cool rag. Yeah. Besides What's that, you talking about overall or here in the back? Overall. Uh, who, who I want to see? I, I watched one of your sets. I like that. Oh, uh, you did. I followed you, so you follow me back. Igor posted, y'all did something, I think it was at the Artist Retreat or All something. Time. Shout out to the Artist Retreat. Shout out to the Artist Retreat. Shout out to Igor. Mm-hmm. They, out to like Artist twice, they be like, man, come through me. I'm going to tell you, I will come. It's That's rare I come mean. out to do shit. Mm-hmm. And I'm not being highfalutin or none of that. But It's just I, rare. No, it's just, I be busy. And I'm not being funny. Gotta stay okay. busy. Shout if I come... Retreat. And I can't find a parking spot within two spot two swipes. I spin the block twice. I'm gone. And I'm not being funny. You gotta park on the main street. No, I, I 
My shit need if to I can't park directly away. across the street from the spot, <laughs> you sound like I me. Right. I gotta be right there in front too. Yeah, and I'm not being highfalutin or nothing. I just, I'm just impatient. I don't want to park around that corner. Yeah, I'm just very impatient. That's a real nigga shit. I like to world. support people shit, so I will send money or it support no through you. Last time I went, ghost I shit the that you may, you'll See, never know that I support you. Because right. we had a whole little lingerie shit dig at the day. Right. Right. It was oh, popping. Oh, he was naked up in that thing with the lingerie on. They was throwing twos and ones at it. Shout out to Teach Bobo. Teach Bobo, she been here. She been on the show. actually, uh, Tisha actually was a script I was stuck oh, on. Oh, she came on here with twice? And she, yeah. the movie, next one after the finish, you, Tisha man. took the script and finished it for me. Okay. okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Tish Boo. Yeah. yeah. She been yeah. on All here. family, all family. Oh. Harvey, what's happening? ITC. My Shaq peoples. Pacers in the house, class of 92. Yeah, you so. know what? I just like that y'all is just laid back like us, like, we can really do. be ourselves on here, you know? Yeah. You can't hide from yourself because everywhere you go, there you are. I was yeah. wondering so how y'all was so gonna look, take. Cause how, I can't be myself. Our, I don't want to be there. This is <laughs> how our show started. So what, like? How many? I, I was telling. So a long time we ago. started before there was podcasts. We right. used to do this at the studio. <laughs> oh yeah, the original. The stuff. original shit. It was called Cocktail Hour, okay. yeah. and there used to be like twelve of us yeah. minimum. Every Friday, <laughs> six o'clock. Belligerently intoxicated. Okay. Belligerently just sitting, oh, no. chopping it up we while we filming. We had a whole, we had a whole like, bar streaming bar. live. I don't want it to go the way. We got. <laughs> I don't want it to go the way. <laughs> we still got. Yeah. He's stupid. <laughs> so it's what rare that we in, but that's what we do. Motherfuckers used to come on the show one way. And, and leave another. Leave outside different way. When they Be come. different when they oh, leave. <laughs> but it didn't matter. I had an office. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So I could stagger into my office and go to sleep. Niggas trying to go drive home and this like, and yeah, like, nigga, I'm going to sleep it off right here. Yeah, yeah, we, exactly. Uh, we had, exactly. Just like right now, we get too bent. My office is on the other side of the wall. I like to pull up and be in the audience. Like, I like to come. Yeah, I need a futon up in this shit thing. Good questions. We've done a couple, uh, mm-hmm. like the vibe did a did a model the mix. Model we've done, thing, yeah, model we've done uh, so we got do we do like outside. We do the movie yeah, drive in. We have done turn the parking lot into a drive in theater, <laughs> uh, showing right. movies and shit. We oh. we do shit. Yeah, we do. So like we that. network. Well, we um, locked in now, so we, we definitely should throw a show here. I feel like in the yeah. parking lot. Cause I'm all about that town business. Isn't Kelder wants to. Uh, Kelder wants to. Kelder did her shit here. Kelder hey, Kelder, Kelder. so Kelder had the 360 boo, had one of the business. Uh, Kafani shot a music video over yeah. the other side. Like hell, this shit was going on. Yeah, we <laughs> network. Okay. Yeah. But it's Kelder did. Kelder did that. Kelder well, did that. Their festival so. in the park. Does it get stressful for you guys? Hmm. Does it get stressful for you guys? Nah, because this is organic. It's fun. Yeah. It's fun. Y'all, y'all love it, yeah. yeah. You love what you do. It's not work. It's What is this? Why are you taking my hair? It's just cool hair. Like, oh, yeah. No, nah, we was doing it, like he said, 12, 13. The morning. Yeah, we been doing it. We, we was doing, doing this before camera, there was. And then we just oh, started. Like, we oh, was streaming. Yeah, we just used to just, because yeah. we had, we, we was doing really this. doing movies and, and hella yeah. shit. So we had. We called the it cocktail yeah. hour back then. So yeah, we, we had all cocktail be hour. in the studio and we would just, yeah. Friday was a day we it all met. It was just good for y'all. Yeah. And now y'all like, no, I can make money off this shit. That's fun. We was doing this shit before there was, before anybody knew what a podcast was. Exactly. Yeah. All wow. that. And it's not Real knocking authentic. nobody who was doing podcasts after or whatever. Yeah. Like, y'all yeah. We, we was doing this shit yeah. before. But then we stopped. Yeah. And we, we stopped. Because stop everybody got, we all, don't get us wrong. We do this shit, but we all got six-figure jobs. We right. work. Exactly. Do regular shit. I need a six-figure job. Yeah, wait a minute. And we like, this is, this is our I business. But we all have yeah, jobs and yeah. other shit. Job, yeah. this, yeah. This, we all business. If you have a degree, I can so fix your like resume me. up and I get you a, a six-figure right. job at the county. We all got a business. Shit, I got a degree in we, high school. Our whole yeah, shit. Yeah, there's, 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 you got he worked at the school. Our whole yeah. unit is is six different black-owned businesses. We come together as a corporation for this, what we do here. But we all have shit outside of here that we do. This is what we do together. Uh, six independent so businesses. Yeah. Oh yeah, we we dub in plus. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. We, yeah. we dub plus. We dub plus in. All right, we I'll be on the Black excellence right. all day. We don't fuck around. Yeah. But um, 
So when things come together organically, so when we do Sorry. movies and stuff, no, you good. It's, it's bring your ass on camera. When we do <laughs> movies, it's all I'm, 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 I'm we really got Tiff in the movie. Right. Like, oh, it's Tiff, don't play. We even put, we even got Tiff to come be in the movie. Why you scared? Come on up here, girl. Come on up here. Come on. You didn't, you been talking and shit. Come on. I'll be in the background. Just come in the background. It is my cousin. Yeah, come say hi. Hey, cousin. What's your name? I'm Mari. Am I with Mari? Mari Bone Slap a Hoe? No, that's my old shit. Like you said, what do I do? Mm -hmm. I'm not um, a comedian or a rapper. Or anything. We didn't ask you all that. We said I'm what you do. I'm a manager at Amazon and I'm security on the side. That's all. <laughs> you got, I do so you got your brass knuckles on. You wear yeah. your socks hey, somewhere. Hey. Hey. Oh, is that the ring <laughs> and the engagement? Oh, thing? no, honey. Oh, no. It's just too far. Oh, I thought it was two rings. Like, she right to the mob. You're picking up Mary on oh, nah, that. No, because you got an engagement ring on anyway. No, 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 no. Oh, you yeah. married to the game? Look. Pop your collar when you talk like that. Okay. <laughs> uh, I mean, <laughs> don't freeze up you, on you, this camera now. Yeah, hey. please don't, because you lie. Hey, Ain't no, no, no redo. No. Oh, no. She knows. She now, knows. as a family hey, member, hey, as a family member of a rising comedian. Uh huh. Yeah. I'm her biggest supporter besides her son. Besides being her biggest supporter, as you see her rise and you mm -hmm. see her name and stuff getting out there, do you find yourself having feelings be that you need to be more protective of her or you need to watch yeah. her back more or do you figure she got this? Or yes. do you feel as her family you need to kinda I think it's both. And, she and, is and it's both. Said, Don't freeze up. She then came and said she got her own place. She then came and stayed with me, mm -hmm. helping me out of my shit because my son kicked my windows in, all the shit, stole all my shoes, you all good. Type of Come shit. on in. So your shoes, you had a lot of them red bottoms up. Yeah, Steve, yeah. hell yeah. Oh no. Steve up in hella, here. Hella dead sock <laughs> shoes, you know, like expensive shit. So like she was there. She was my bodyguard. Like this this, this is really my big cousin. Like I like nothing in the world can stop us from fucking with each other. This bitch drove my car to LA. I knew she was gonna say that. Ain't gonna lie and tell me she was in what you say? I said I was in uh I said I was in uh And I'm still fucking with her. Thanks man. Now, 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 what's up, blood? Now let me ask you this. Now let's say it's a year from now. Uh-huh. It's a year from now and Cat Williams has called and said mm -hmm. Canary, I want you to go on the road with me. Mm. Mm -hmm. And Canary says to you, I gotta have my day one with me. Mm. You going? I'm going. I'm taking off work all the shit. Hell yeah. What? I'm there. Oh, you down. She, okay. Now, y'all in South Carolina. Oh, yeah. Canary yeah. says some wild shit defends <laughs> half the crowd and they wait for it in the parking lot. Uh, Hell no. You oh, going go. You, go, you, out, no. you out there, there. You there. out there with us? You out there with her Am back I? to back? Am I? I'll cover up. Hey. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm, the I'm the guy that everybody be looking at be like, oh, she is queer and all the... Mm -hmm. I'm going to portray that. Okay. Because I'm going to pop out. She's like, oh, I need okay. some bitches out of my house. I'm like, oh, okay. bitch, which one? Now, Canary you know says, no, nah, we ain't tripping. It's peace. I need that. But V. Andrea... Goes out there and starts swinging. See, I don't even she's move not like doing that. that. She's not like, No, it's completely out of character. She gonna swing. We in South Carolina and the liquor is stronger. In fact, she ain't drinking. I'm gonna start drink, it. She's drinking I'm gonna start it, but we gonna finish it all together. Basically, <laughs> basically, Mari, we asking you is you with the shit? We oh, she's definitely shit? that family okay. member. Definitely is. I'm a real gang member, okay? She got a few. Now, one, now, one, now, one, now, one, now, one, now, one more question. Canary is world famous now. But you know what the world famous, the, the temptations. It's a nigga like me saying, I got this powder, I got this, I got that. But you ain't doing it. It ain't poly no more. It's now it's multi-poly. You ain't doing it. But Polyamorous is the way to If, if, but you, but, but. If you start telling her, Canary, you self-destructive, she might cut you off because all these yes men. Let me men. tell you, she just Use was in that. the hospital. Would you be brave enough to, to help Use her? To I'm all the way yeah. on her ass right now. She was right. just in the hospital. What you was on in the hospital? She said, I ate a burrito. It had all veggies in it. You I said, it. but you ate the bread and the right. rice and the sour cream, all that shit. I thought I was doing something I healthy. Said, she said, I thought I was doing something healthy. I said, that shit ain't healthy. 
It's yeah. still unhealthy. I say if you eat a salad and you put all that. this other shit on it, the, this ranch, you know, it's making it unhealthy. You gotta eat avocado toast and greens. You, you're only <laughs> eating the greens. Man, he's like, I'm gonna I'm, I'm, I'm give y'all. Like y'all ready for the shit? I'm ready for the game. I'm ready for the game. You ready for the game? Y'all ready? Yeah, I'm ready. It's the three in the morning shit you can get right now. <laughs> Listen, I'm a connoisseur, mm-hmm. which means I'm uh, I study shit. Mm-hmm. Orgasms burn calories. <laughs> Uh, Hello? Only 200 calories. No, I like that, though. How much work is that's you doing prior? That's so all I heard. That's why they come in multiples. Mm-hmm. How much work is you doing? No, they nice really. Nice guys uh, finish last. They don't come in multiples. Do they? No, no they, they don't. don't. Do guys no, they don't. Sure? No, they don't. No, they don't. I know they do. Uh, Too see? much of a good thing to kill you. If it's yeah. two seconds of that, you, that shit ain't now, you can't can drink too much water. If you want all these orgasms, you better go get your boyfriend. All I'm saying is. I like orgasms. All I'm saying yeah, is, get your boy I'm saying I like orgasm. Because I got shit to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I got somewhere to be in the morning. When so. I pass it, don't look at me. I'm sorry. I'm yeah. a real nigga. I'm going to sleep. I if you want to call, hey, call back. Girl. Well, hey. hey if you want to call girl. back, niggas. Niggas. Boy, niggas. Trust me. <laughs> Trust me. When you as wonderful as I am, you you gonna get called back. In fact, okay. here go the thing, fellas. So let me give y'all. Let me give you niggas some real game. You, niggas you ain't never gotta sit here. in the mirror and worry about your weight, <laughs> nigga. Get you a here, bigger man. shirt and a bigger wallet, oh, and she gonna yeah. love you all the same. <laughs> if she really see, see the way. See, I'm gonna tell you a secret on how women is set up. And here's some women right here, so they gonna agree or disagree. But here's mm-hmm. something about women oh, set we, up. Fuck like Mary Kill. If. <laughs> If, Why he just said? If you fuck with somebody that sincerely Say fucks it. with you, Give if you it. fuck with somebody, see a lot of you niggas is is chasing them. If you do get some ass, it's some oh here, man, God. damn ass. Oh, they're getting that. They they like, getting uh, that. Uh, oh, nigga, here, right, right. Yeah, but yeah, if no, you go out, don't call me again, no, nigga. No, if no, you no, go no. out and really <laughs> fuck no, with, no, 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 if you put yourself, if I'm you pose to be chosen, you like if this. you the type of nigga uh, that can get chosen, chosen, if you can get chosen with your mouth closed, if you get chosen with your mouth closed, if you get chosen, if you really get chosen and you really fuck with who fuck with you, all that other shit don't matter. Nigga, she gonna love you, and another nigga can't. <laughs> another nigga can't say nothing. Okay. Now, if you gonna chase them, if you persuading them, That's you manipulating them, right you deceiving there. them, you got to do all this game to keep them. Right. Well, then if you Lies. ain't getting it right, you ain't doing these things. Another nigga can slide in. Lies. But if she truly one hundred percent love you, but see, a lot of y'all, like I said, you don't play on your level. Mm-hmm. You you you'll be a bum nigga pretending to be something else for you to book her. And then and then but <laughs> you can only fuck in the bug, but you can only the tax bracket. Your daddy a tax bracket. You can only pretend for so that's long, the and then when she starts getting a glimpse of the real you, you when she's this she and that, like then she yes, becomes nigga. disillusioned with you, and then another nigga can come. So if you always follow the rules, Dick be who you say you is, and if you call yourself speaking it into existence, or I'm claiming it, or I'm faking it to I make it, but then nigga get on your grind and really go get it. Right. You know what I'm saying? But, Amen. but if you out here shaking and faking, if you shaking and faking, or you just using a little charm to get her, you could probably get them draws. But nine months from now, she gonna be like, the fuck I ever saw in this thing. Right. It don't take or much to. Hey, I'm gonna tell you something. It don't take much to fuck. I just want to you fuck again. Man, it's yeah. over and over me for conversation around the nation. I think it's a turn off on oh, baby. I, I think Can't you buy your The mental stimulation <laughs> brings <laughs> the gyration. It's about um, consistency for me. Yeah. Like I said, you got to be who you say you is. Exactly. Nice. If you say you this nigga, then you got to exactly. be that nigga. Be that. Yeah, nice. Is, nigga. But you got to be that nigga all the way. What y'all should say? Stand on me. Stand on me. But you know the thing, fellas, and that ain't saying, I ain't saying you got to ball all this night, because you can also tell one of them if she don't like you, like, hey, I ain't getting it I right now. I was catching the bus getting now, three days. Saying, if she like you, she exactly. gonna still she fuck gonna, with exactly. you. Right? But now, she might not keep yeah. fucking with you for years, if two years from now, you're still you in that same ass month. Exactly. She what what is so I ain't saying you gotta have a whole bunch of money, this and that. You just got to find out who you What's the time limit if you got a bro Consistent dick, consistent jizzles. Consistent euphoria will always rule. How long can she be broke? If she broke, and she say, if she say, oh, I want to go be a librarian or something like that. Well, no, she's still gonna be broke even when she achieved this career. However, so, so I'm obviously choosing her. 
But if two years from now, if when I meet her, she say, oh, I need to take these two, three classes to get this librarian degree, and that's what I'm going to be happy doing, I'm going to be like, okay, you ain't going to bring in no bread. No, yeah, you're but not you're going to really be happy, to cool. But now if two years later, she still ain't completed these three classes, I'm like, damn, you was already picking a bullshit career, and you ain't even putting no grind towards that. <laughs> two now I got to start looking at you You don't like, give her two or three years? I'm giving her two or three months. No, oh. no, I take time to actually exactly. achieve something. And oh, plus, you also got to remember. I just get a nigga two or three days. Like, Hold on. No. But see, here's the thing, Durag. But Durag, one thing you got to remember. You got to but hold on, do that. You yeah, gotta accept yeah, people for who they is. I so if you meet, if like you meet, you gotta learn the person. If, you if I meet a in. full grown woman mm -hmm. and she ain't achieved what's to me yeah, sure. basic ass goals, then I already you know that there's some you, type you of problem in there. <laughs> Here, you can you get a seat. You gonna give me your seat? You so yeah. sweet. That's a half like, a seat. Like, that ain't even a whole seat. Just, like you gonna realize? Come down. You, 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 you gonna realize that there's something going on in her life? So maybe you gotta. Maybe she has problems in her family. Maybe there's some dysfunction. So you gotta unwind all that shit to get her to where she needs to go. Yeah, have a seat. You drop her shit. I said, okay, well, I don't know, cause I'll be irritated with a hoe. I mean, Everybody if they making forward Dama progress, Dama 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 if they making forward <laughs> progress, I ain't gonna never fall. Nobody <laughs> making forward progress. I mean, they she take care of you. Any motion yeah, is better than no motion. Right. I feel like if they take care of you and everything else. If you can't buy what I can't buy myself, I don't need to be around you, nigga. Right. Don't come out a ten year old that's cooking steak and lobster know how to butterfly the motherfucker. So if you ain't doing that, what if he massaging your feet every moment? I'm cleaning up. Massage. I was gonna say. Hey, well, hey, with this one right here, with this one right here. Fellas, you better pay like you weigh. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. And I don't even but with ask the motherfucker. You got the rose. You got the rose. You got the rose. Three thousand. No, this is yeah. the thing. I don't even ask the motherfucker. She right. say you got to write. You can write her poetry every day. This will say you better break bread. I got a no, break bread. But that's the thing. What you fucking write? I got a nigga pay my house. She worked two jobs. She got. I'm in love with that. Oh, as soon as that's the reason why she worked two jobs. They can help me. They gonna shut that nigga up. Yeah, you know, like, yeah. Okay. Don't, 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 don't. And not just when and he does, just when he is. That's the thing. He said he got it. He told me last week, he like, oh, he might be doing all the way back. Oh, oh, baby. And you sell weed? Oh, yeah. How you sell weed? Focus, we work. You sell five and better than women. He should have been a man. I'm there. I would have just said, hey, I just want to smoke no weed. I want to ask the person. I don't want to smoke. 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 This is like five in a month, okay? This is another deal. This podcast is over Okay? You can buy your own weed. Why do I Wait a minute. So you'll be with a nigga that paints your house, but he broke? I can't do that. If he's doing something that he to be I can get the I can get the I can help that nigga get money. What you mean? Okay, this is over. I don't mind helping a nigga get money. What if a nigga Exactly. Why they call him the maintenance man? You trying to help the nigga get money. The milkman. Food, the mailman, the, really the electrician, the phone man. I can do all things. No question. Why am I working for you? Definitely got a question. No off-camera question. No off-camera question. I can't. You got to come on camera. You got to come right here and ask the question. You know the rules. Because I'm trying to end you. Y'all trying to know the rules. Miss Sexy said... Well, Miss Sexy said the best... Person to have the mechanic and the plumber that he cooks. See, I got a mechanic, he a mechanic, he work on houses, he can cook, and he can do the deed. You know, and he rub my feet. All of those things. That's what you want to know about my hair. He just like, I just, 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 I just
I got to show all those. Do you like that excitement then? That danger that come with the mother? Yes, but it's like we'll go back to the mother. Plus, you know what we see. I make this side. I be on the back of the mother. You know, potatoes. My son is now in jail. He's 17. You know, he just turned 17. You guys got to sit out till next year. That's why I said I felt what you were saying because I put myself out all the time. And my son is. We are chilling. You know, this ain't no. That's what happens with this. I I'm saying that I never had no time off. I never I said we had to do that. I don't even like what that. Time well, well, we well, 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 you come on set with me, I'm going to have a stack. Okay. I don't want to get anything else about it. Y'all make lamb? Oh, rack of lamb? I like lamb chops. Yeah, but it's like, you know, it's fucked up. Like, this dude was coming on the other night. He was like, you don't know how to do it. I said, baby, I know we've been going for super long. Damn, every night. Mm-hmm. When I'm tired, I work 12 no, hours a day. I work seven days a week. I have a manager. It's time to go. Right. So, it's time to go. It's time to go. It's time to go. I just want to reel this back in. Wait, wait, time to go. I want to thank everybody for tuning in. I said 10. All right, go ahead. There's no one left. I was telling them, hold on so you can. Yeah, thank you. Work your magic. <laughs> yeah. Um, I want to uh, thank everybody for tuning in tonight. Uh, we've been going for a minute. Uh, it's, it's tell everybody where they can find you at. I want to thank y'all. Tell everybody where they can find you out on social media. T-H-E-E, Andrea Nicole, on all platforms. Thanks. What about you, Mari? Yeah. You can pop your ass in there. Y'all want to know my Instagram. No, we don't give you a shit. Come on, what is it? It's Mar to you, bitch. I T S. I'm professional. M A R. Mar to you, bitch. Okay, okay. It's Mar to you, bitch. I T S M A R. It's Mar. T O Y O U B X T C H. Damn. 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 When you bring, fam- when when you bring family members right. to the podcast, okay. Okay. I'm already offended. I'm Canary the Comedian. The if you look up TikTok, I'm, I'm Canary underscore. Offended. You ever heard that? Canary <laughs> underscore Comedian. Canary <laughs> 2. Yeah, is it yeah, hella funny? <laughs> canary <laughs> other funny on IG? On oh, IG yeah, and Canary there. Clothing yeah. Line. My original yeah, page is Canary underscore Comedian. I'm working on getting it back, y'all. So just don't look at me on TikTok or Instagram, I'm everywhere. And, and y'all, y'all, y'all podcast on Mondays can be found where? On, on Twitch. Twitch. TV forward slash Bay Life Radio. Sip and tea with sugar and spice. Ain't nothing nice. Ain't nothing nice. <laughs> and donate every, to the cash app, man. What's the cash app? Oh, you probably. Right, facts. She must be doing some sugar, the letter <laughs> is spice. That's the cash app. Donate to it. Well, we do it for free. All the time. We don't do it. <laughs> 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 now, we don't do it for free. We don't ask y'all, for nothing. Y'all can find me at Fell Films. And I would like to let everybody know I have a new character coming that I just inv- I just invented. Okay. I'm calling him Do Rag, and it just came to me. I was inspired, <laughs> oh, and now I'm gonna, oh, yeah. and now I'm gonna go worldwide with it. She really? didn't already have somebody try to steal from her. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say no name. I will. Don't say no name. I will. Floods, Kevin Floods, tell them where they can find you at. And it's your boy, K A Double M. You can find me on all platforms Camouflage, K A M M F L G E. And if you can't find that, just look up Rail. You'll find me, R E Double M. And be on the lookout for his new video. Just look up Rail. We shot it right here on location. And it's great. You know what I'm picturing? I'm picturing, I'm picturing her on the hook of one of your songs with Drew Rag doing the intro and Mari dancing in the video. Let's make it great. And we got a new video uh, about to drop. Me and Stalin got a new video we just shot last week. So, yeah. It should be dropping next week. Okay. I don't have you TikTok. TikTok. I don't do TikTok. My TikTok is my biggest do, platform. I don't have TikTok. No so, I do. <laughs> Can I? And it's my right. turn. Y'all in the oh, industry. Oh, yeah, yeah, boss. Hey. Yeah. Boss man. I need somebody and to work. Oh, yeah. Can I get y'all to, like, for real? Y'all, y'all yeah. niggas hella loud in the background. It's the cognac. I don't give a fuck. That ain't a fashion over there. Cognac. It's a fashion. For real, though. Hey, this guy. Yeah, go ahead and hook it up. Yeah. And I'm Deshaun. You can find me at Cognac underscore confessionals on IG. 
Cognac Confessionals on Facebook, uh, Cognac Confessionals on YouTube, and you can always find me where? In your bitch, bitch dreams. dreams. Why? Because that's where I reside. Ooh. Ooh. And you know what I'm saying? Let's go hey, nice guys finish last. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I like this guy. You know what I'm, saying, I'm just telling you, man. Hey, that's what we do. Uh-huh. Pippin, you know, pippin. I he, appreciate he real everybody like, You know what no I'm saying? Hesitation. I'm a player, not a pair. You know what I'm okay. saying? Okay, yeah. yeah so let them know. Hey, conversation running nation, procrastination is a violation. Run me my money, okay. man. Hey. 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 Give hey. me my money. Uh, but Give no, me my money. I appreciate <laughs> everybody for tuning in. Y'all can catch us next week. We got uh, Eddie Projects, Eddie Pithouse next week. We got uh, Tiff and uh, Angie coming up. We got Brother Broski and Big Twan coming on soon, uh, the week after. So we got some big shit coming. Tune in for everything. Uh, I appreciate everybody. And uh, now it's time to say goodbye hey. to all, all my Negro friends. Hey, oh, catch y'all next week. You ain't got to go, but I get the fuck about it.